Transmigration Super Debt System. Chatper 1. No, don't do this. A voice attracted the attention of everyone in the classroom. I saw everyone looking at a boy at the last table in the fifth row of the classroom with surprise, joking, and malicious eyes. Dragon, Sun, Sky. A sharp trembling voice made all the students in the class cover their ears, looking at the male teacher on the podium with horror. Long Rishan was pulled out of his dream by the voice, and he couldn't help but rubbed his eyes and glanced at the classroom. Seeing that his classmates were looking at him with strange eyes, he couldn't help looking at the podium. Okay, Long Rishan, do you really think you can speak the sky? It's okay to sleep in class, but you're still talking in your sleep, it's okay to talk in your sleep, and you say such perverted words, are you being slapped by the sun in your dreams? A roar from the podium rushed into his ears fiercely, and Eunuch Lee looked at him angrily. Father-in-law Lee, whose real name is Lee Gong Gong, is the head teacher of class 2 of their senior year. He has a bad temper and the students don't like him. But his wife is the vice principal, so no one dares to contradict him at school, except for one person. Can you try it? Long Rishan took out his ears and said unhurriedly. You? You dare to contradict, let me go out to the playground for ten laps, and then call your parents tomorrow. Li Gong Gong roared angrily. Tisk tisk, sorry, the parents are gone. Long Rishan shrugged indifferently and said. No one saw the pain deep in his eyes. What do you mean? Li Gong Gong asked in confusion. Teacher, Long Rishan's parents had a car accident a few days ago. A boy sitting in the front row whispered. This, don't do this next time. It will affect the study of other students. In this way, I will approve you for a half-day vacation. Go out to relax and breathe. Li Gong Gong's face softened and looked at him softly. He just came back from vacation, but he didn't expect such a big thing to happen at his student's home, he didn't know yet. Although this student usually does not like to study, he will not cause trouble, not to mention that he is also a father. Thank you, teacher. Long Rishan stood up, bent slightly at him, and then walked out of the classroom in the eyes of everyone's envy. The reason why he was talking in his sleep in class just now was because he had that dream again. In that dream, he dreamed of being robbed, and it was a robbery. He walked out of class two of senior three and walked towards the vast playground. He is a third-year student of Kintang High School in Kintang Town, Zhancheng City. He is 1.78 meters tall and is fair and fair. It was 4.30 in the afternoon, and the school was in session time. But at the moment there are still some gym classes on the playground. Boy, come here for me. When Long Rishan looked at the students running enthusiastically on the playground, a sharp object pressed against his waist. Because it was summer, the sharp feeling could penetrate through thin clothes. Then a pair of big hands pulled his collar and pulled towards the toilet. Boom! In the toilet, the owner of those big hands kicked Long Rishan on the wet ground, and the sour smell of uric poured into his nostrils. Only then did he see the person who kicked him down. I saw a sturdy young man looking at him fiercely with a knife. Boy, I heard that you are very good, even you dare to touch Zhao Xiao's girl. The young man said arrogantly. You mean Mu Shuaying? He <laughs> he, if she bumped into me, it counts as a bump, so let's bump it. Long Rishan stood up slowly from the ground with a sneer on his face, and wiped his hands on the school uniform casually. Mud, did you stand up? When the young man saw him like that, he was furious and kicked out fiercely. Boom! Long Rishan, who was unprepared, was kicked in the stomach in an instant and hit the door. A huge pain came from his stomach, and a trace of blood overflowed from the corner of his mouth. Boy, don't be so arrogant, this time Zhao Xiao just asked me to tell, next time it won't be so simple, understand. The young man tugged at his hair, the sharp blade patted his face, and said with a sneer. Then, with a strong hand, he slammed Long Rishan's head against the door. Boom! Then the young man walked out of the toilet without looking at it. 
Cough, cough. Long Rishan shook his dizzy head, stood up slowly while covering his stomach, and gently wiped the blood from the corner of his mouth with his hand. Then he took out his mobile phone from his trouser pocket and looked at the screen saver of the family portrait, his bright eyes were covered with a mist of water. Mom and Dad, are you okay down there? Long Rishan's slender fingers gently brushed the screen with water stains, and his thin lips spit out this sentence gently, with a little choking. Ding! Do you miss the person you want to see? As long as ten merit points, they can appear in front of you immediately. The phone vibrated for a while, and a sentence appeared on the screen, covering the family portrait. Long Rishan frowned, and then wanted to turn it off. But no matter how he pressed it, the words were still on the screen, and there was still a flash of light. Looking at the shining words, he couldn't help feeling agitated, and the more he thought about it, the more angry he became. Boom! He raised his right hand suddenly and slammed the phone to the ground. Ding, ding! Attempts to damage the system, the system binds itself, and the host will be fined. Binding succeeded. In view of the limited personal ability of the host, the system autonomously activates the installment repayment mechanism. Chatper 2 Long Rishan stared at the light curtain in front of him, and rubbed his eyes in disbelief. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Points, 0 Repayment, 0 1000, Term, 7 Days Low Martial World not open. JOA world, not opened. Mythic world, 1, random, unexpected mission reward. Rebirth chance, 1 time, unexpected mission reward. Guru, is this true? Long Rishan swallowed, and shiveringly stretched out his finger and tapped on the mythical world. Randomly entered the mythical world, are you sure? A metallic voice sounded in his mind. He nodded subconsciously. The mythological world is drawn, and the world of journey to the west, the return of the great sage opens. The debtor, the beggar, the old nine, begins to transmit. I'll go, isn't this an animated movie? When he finished saying this, his figure disappeared into the toilet. The city of Chang'an is surrounded by mountains and demons. Bang, oops. In a dilapidated thatched hut, Long Rishan sat on the ground and grinned in pain. Raising his hands, some black, sticky things were on them, and there was also a stench, which made him nauseated and a little nauseated. Vomit. What is this place? Long Rishan rubbed his hands on the thatch indiscriminately, feeling disgusted for a while. Then quickly walked out of this stinking thatched hut. Call. After rushing out, he took a breath of fresh air. Then he looked at his surroundings. I saw that most of the houses around are made of wood, which are very simple and simple. But the sky is gloomy, giving people a strong sense of depression. It turns out that this is true. I really have a system, which means that I have a chance to be reborn. Long Rishan whispered a little excitedly. Although he doesn't watch it often, he will flip it when he is bored, and he has a system for the protagonist so he can counterattack and become a winner in life. Is there anything more exciting than this? This is the city in the return of the Great Sage? It's too broken, it's more ancient than ancient times. After being excited, he spit out. Of course, he has watched the return of the Great Sage. The front is very scary, the middle is very funny, and the back is very sad and bloody animated movies, which are very good. I don't know if the monkey has been released now. If not, it would be miserable. Long Rishan thought of this, and a trace of fear rose in his heart. He remembered that at the beginning of the movie, Chang'an City was a place where mountain demons were crisscrossed, and he didn't know if it was Chang'an City. Wanting to find out if this is Chang'an City, Long Rishan pulled up his legs and walked to the crowded place. Come on, take a look at the good bow it's not a problem to kill the mountain demon. Treasure knives with strong, freshly baked knives, easy to use and cheap. Master, come in and play. Long Rishan walked all the way, 
and what he looked at the most was weapons and the like, and he ate less. And the clothes on the road are not luxurious. But his attire is so eye-catching, with the white and blue school uniform and dry short hair, it's really weird on the street in this robe and coat. Master, is this Chang'an city? Long Rishan went to a stall selling steamed buns and asked an old grandpa who was over fifty years old. Yeah, boy, have you just arrived in Chang'an city? The slightly tired old grandpa raised a smile and asked softly. Yeah, what's wrong? Uncle. When Long Rishan heard that it was Chang'an city, his heart was already covered with a grey shadow. Hey, since you're here, don't go out anymore. Now the mountain monsters are all over the place, and I don't know how many people have died. The old man sighed. Thank you uncle, I will. Long Rishan nodded with a heavy heart. The mountain demon is here. A fearful roar came from the tall city wall. Chapter 3 Young man, hurry up and hide, the mountain demon is coming. The old man shouted in fear, and then he didn't even want the stall and ran into the small wooden house next to him. At the same time, the pedestrians on the street also ran wildly, looking like the end of the world. Roar, roar, roar. There was a terrifying cry. Boom. The sky was instantly covered with black shadows, and a mountain monster of more than two meters leaped over the city wall and landed on the roof or the ground, making a loud noise. Ah, help! Help me! Some people who haven't escaped screamed in horror. Bang! Pfft! But how fast these mountain monsters are, they rushed towards the pedestrians one by one. When Long Rishan saw the mountain demon, the vision was more terrifying than watching a movie. Like the hunter in Resident Evil, his legs were a little weak and he was at a loss. Grandpa, come in. Suddenly, a hand as thin as chicken feet grabbed his hand and yanked it violently. This surprised him, but it turned out that his legs were weak, and he was pulled over without the slightest strength to resist. With a flick of his eyes, he was pulled into a small wooden house, and in the dimness, he saw a thin figure quickly closing the door. Who are you? Long Rishan asked nervously. Ian Gong, don't you remember me? I'm the old ninth master. You lent me all the money you had when you were a child and asked me to do a little business. Don't you remember? Lao Ju Gong's old voice said rustlingly. When he said this, Long Rishan was impressed. The system seemed to have said that the person he wanted to collect debts was called Lao Ju Gong. In other words, this person in front of him is his target. Remember to remember. Emperor, you said that you wanted to cultivate immortals, but your physical talent is not enough. This is the anti-spirit grass that I have been asking for over the years, you take it. A glowing grass appeared in Lao Ju Gong's hand and stuffed it into Long Rishan's hand. This. SHH, don't speak. Just as he was about to speak, Lao Ju Gong covered his mouth and a voice sounded in his mind at the same time. Boom! The door was slammed open in an instant, and a ferocious head stuck in, staring at them with blood-red eyes. Emperor, run quickly! The old ninth grandpa shouted in horror, pushing Long Rishan away, picking up a knife from the side and rushing towards the mountain demon in a panic. Puff! I saw the mountain demon slammed violently, and half of the corpse fell to the ground splashing on Longri and covering his body with blood. But he couldn't care about it anymore, fear filled his mind, causing him to stare at the bigger and bigger bloody mouth with terrified eyes. Puff! In the toilet. A figure appeared in it. Long Rishan leaned against the door motionless, and drops of cold sweat flowed from his body, wetting his school uniform. His eyes are still staring, the horror in his eyes has not dissipated, and the bloody mouth cannot be dissipated in his mind for a long time. Then a dizziness came, and then the body fell back. Boom! Some water spots splashed. In the clean white room, there were two iron-framed beds. Long Rishan was lying on one of the beds, his face pale. Potion is still hanging in his hand. And there was a girl lying beside the bed, 
a trace of crystal clear liquid flowed out from her pink lips, and her eyebrows moved occasionally, which was extremely cute. Da da da. There was a sound of footsteps, and the door opened immediately, with long hair reaching to the waist, a delicate face, wearing a snow white dress, a pair of white jade like feet, and black high heeled shoes, very beautiful. Well, Mr. Yang, you're here. The girl who was licking and sleeping was awakened and stood up immediately. Xioxiquin rubbed Matsutake's eyes and said softly. How is Long Rishan, are you awake? Yang Yuying walked to the bedside, looked at Long Rishan on the bed and asked softly. No, Teacher Yang. Zhao Kameng shook his head and pouted. She didn't want to come to guard Long Rishan. She didn't like him at first, but the head teacher insisted on her coming so she had no choice but to come. Um. Long Rishan's eyelids moved, and he made a voice that attracted the voices of the two women. Chat per four. Long Rishan, are you awake? Yang Yuying hurried to the bedside and said softly. Mr. Yang, why are you here? Long Rishan covered his head with his right hand, frowned and propped himself up with his left hand. Slower. Yang Yuying quickly held his hand and helped him put the pillow. Long Rishan felt his hand, and couldn't help but feel a little reaction. Thank you, Teacher Yang. Yang Yuying is an English teacher in class 2 of Senior 3. She is recognized by the whole school as a goddess. So far, no man has been able to pluck this fairy flower, and no man has even held her hand. Now that he actually felt this feeling first, maybe the principal would regret sending her here. Zhao Kameng, who was on the side, saw him like that, and was even more disgusted in his heart, and his face was turned to one side. Long Rishan, why did you faint in the toilet? Fortunately, your classmates found out. Yang Yuying asked curiously. It's okay, maybe it's anemia, I didn't eat at noon, so. Of course Long Rishan couldn't tell the truth so he made such an excuse. Well, the doctor also said that you are fine. You can take another day off. If you are fine, you can leave the hospital. The school has already asked you for leave. Yang Yuying nodded and said with concern. Mr. Yang, I'm fine, I'm leaving the hospital now. Long Rishan hurriedly shook his head and said. It's okay, the hospital is reimbursed by the school you don't need to pay. Yang Yuying thought that it was because of the money, and said quickly. It's not about money, I'm fine, I don't want to stay in the hospital. Long Rishan said firmly. This, well, I'll ask the doctor to take a look again, and if it's all right, I'll be discharged from the hospital. Seeing his resolute expression, Yang Yuying had no choice but to compromise. After the doctor came, he took the instrument and listened to him, pressed his hand a few times, and then left after saying that there was nothing to do. Seeing this, Yang Yuying went through the discharge procedures without saying anything. In a residential building not far from Kintang High School. When Long Rishan came home, he lay on the bed and stared at the ceiling in a daze. In just one day, he experienced a death, and now he still has that terrifying mouth in his mind. After half an hour, he came back to his senses, and a screen appeared in front of him. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Point, 1 Merit Points, 0.51 Repayment, 0-1000, Term, 6 Days Low Martial World, Not Open, Can Be Opened JOA World, Not Opened Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10. Mission, Collect Debts from Lao Jugong, Completed, Reward, 1. Debt Point. Item, Reverse Spirit Grass. Sure enough, the rebirth opportunity was used by me, and I would really die in other worlds. Long Rishan was a little scared, if it wasn't for the chance to be reborn, there would really be no such person in this world. At the same time, he also regretted it a lot. If he hadn't been so rambunctious, this chance of rebirth would have allowed him to grow faster. 
reverse spirit grass. He still remembered that the old ninth master gave it to him, saying that it was for immortal cultivation. What is this? Suddenly he saw an exclamation mark next to the word N.I. Linko, and he couldn't help but click it. Inverse spirit grass, it has the effect of transforming one's physique and becomes a spiritual body, which can be eaten by ordinary people. This, it seems like a cow. Seeing the spirit body, Long Rishan's body couldn't help trembling, and then he tapped his finger on the kneeling grass. A white light flashed, and a crystalline grass appeared in his hand, scattered with little stars. When he saw this nervous grass, his eyes couldn't help being blurred. It was so beautiful, even more beautiful than a woman. In addition to feeling beautiful, he can also feel a powerful energy coming from it, making him feel comfortable. After looking at it for a while, he shoved the anti-spirit grass into his mouth. After the inverse spirit grass entered his mouth, it instantly turned into a stream of heat and slid into his throat. At the same time, his body started to get hot, and bursts of tearing sensation came from his body, causing his body to bow all of a sudden. What? A burst of pain hit his brain, causing him to cry out. Fortunately, this building belongs to him, otherwise it must be heard. As time passed, a stream of black and red things flowed out of his body, and the pain slowly disappeared. Chapter 5 Long Rishan's expression slowly relaxed, but the next moment, his face changed. Ouch, what the hell is this, it smells so bad. Long Rishan covered his nose and jumped up and rushed into the toilet. Looking at himself in the mirror, surrounded by a layer of black stuff, and a stench came from above, he instantly got goosebumps and was extremely disgusting. Resisting nausea, he quickly turned on the shower and rushed towards him. As the black currents flowed down, the fair skin was gradually exposed, and beautiful lines were depicted on his body. Ten minutes later, he stood naked in front of the mirror, looking at the perfect figure in the mirror with a happy smile from the corner of his eyes. Is this really me? Long Rishan touched himself in disbelief. What a powerful anti-spirit grass! He felt that his body had become stronger. Before, his body was a little worse than that of an adult. It was difficult for him to carry 50 caddies of rice for 10 steps, but now, he can carry 100 caddies of rice for 10 steps. It's a little more powerful than the people who work on the construction site. At the same time, he also felt something in the air that made him very comfortable, but he couldn't absorb it. Then he put on some narcissistic gestures and put on his clothes. The sportswear that was washed a little white was put on him, covering his perfect figure, making him look a little thin. Then he went into the kitchen and started cooking. After his parents left, with the help of his uncle and the others, he completed the funeral, and then he lived alone. His parents left him a house that had just been renovated for less than two months, with three floors and a deposit of 10,000 yuan. For a 17-year-old who has never worked, he knows that 10,000 yuan is very little, because his mobile phone alone costs more than 3,000 yuan. So he just boiled a pack of instant noodles, added a super protein egg, and the meal was good. Sigh. He sucked a big mouthful of noodles into his mouth, and after smacking a few times, he opened the system interface. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Point, 1 Merit Points, 0 0.51 Repayment, 0 slash 1000, Term, 5 Days Low Martial World, Not Open, Can Be Opened J.O. World, Not Opened Mythical World the return of the great sage of journey to the west, merit points, 10. Mission, none. Items, none. There are only five days left for this repayment. I don't know what will happen, alas. Although he thinks so, he will not try and not pay it back. If he puts his life in it, it will be over. Long Rishan clicked on the repayment point. The host repays RMB 1000. Are you sure? Yes. Long Rishan nodded. Ding. His cell phone rang, 
picked it up and saw that it was a message. Zanya Bank your account ending in 7717 will withdraw 1000.00 yuan on May 7, and the current balance is 9500.00 yuan. Successful repayment, reward 1 debt point. The system prompt sounded from his mind. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Points, 2 Merit Points, 0.51 Repayment, 0 slash 10,000, Term, 20 Days Low Martial World, Not Open, Can Be Opened J.O.O. World, Not Opened Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10 Mission, none. Items, none. 10,000. 20 days, is this possible? Do you have to ask someone to borrow money? Long Rishan frowned and muttered to himself. He is still a student and has no source of income at all. Even if he still has 9,500 yuan, he doesn't know what to do with the 500 yuan short of it. In addition, he has to eat and drink for 20 days. Forget it, the boat will naturally go straight to the bridge. If it's a big deal, just ask my uncle to borrow it. First, figure out what the debt is for. He tapped the word debt point on the system interface. The debt point, for opening and entering the world. That's how it is. Chapter 6 The next day, Long Rishan got up early in the morning, washed quickly, and walked to the school. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Point, 1 Merit Points, 0.51 Repayment, 0 slash 10,000, Term, 19 Days Lo Wu World, Ming Dynasty, Debt Point 1 J.O. World, Not Opened Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10 Mission, none. Items, none. He had already figured out what a debt point was last night, and used it to open the world of the Daiming Dynasty. He needed one debt point to enter the Daiming Dynasty, and he was not ready yet. His home is not far from the school, so he was at the school gate in a few minutes. Yo, isn't this long Rishan? Didn't you faint in the toilet? Crawling out so soon? Ha ha ha. I saw three young men walking arrogantly in front of Long Rishan, patted him on the shoulder, and laughed. Li Bai, it's rare that you are not late today. Long Rishan glanced at the young man in the lead and said lightly. I'm in a good mood today, so I came early. How about a basketball game? Li Bai raised the corner of his mouth, provocatively. Not interested. Long Rishan said lightly and walked to the classroom. Li Ying will come. Li Bai raised his lips slightly and said lightly. When? Long Rishan stopped and asked without looking back. School at noon. It is good. Back in the classroom, he took out the book and read it. Due to family affairs, he has been negative for a long time, and his grades are at the bottom, so he must keep up with the progress as soon as possible, and after half a month, it will be the college entrance examination. As time passed, students entered the classroom one by one. Everyone who enters the classroom will look at Long Rishan. As the bell rang, Li Gong Gong walked in with two books. Long Rishan, are you feeling better? Li Gong Gong looked at him and asked with concern. Thank you teacher for your concern, it's much better. Long Rishan nodded and replied with a smile. That's good. Well, now let's go to class. Soon, three classes passed. After class, Long Rishan walked to the basketball court alone without eating. At this time, there were already two teams playing basketball on the basketball court, including Li Bai. Come on, put on your jersey. Li Bai saw him, walked over to him, took a jersey and threw it at him. At this time, the get out of class was over and some students who liked watching basketball gathered around. Long Rishan glanced at him lightly, then took off his school uniform. Who is that? 
he's in good shape. Yeah, why haven't I seen this handsome guy before? Some girls shouted. Some guys are jealous. What's the use of being good looking and handsome, and the grades are terrible? That's right, the tail of the crane in class 2 of senior 3, Long Rishan. Just be envious, jealous, and hate. He is handsome and has a good figure. Some girls retorted. I don't know if he has a girlfriend. It's not your turn. You. Long Rishan changed his clothes without knowing him, and someone started arguing for him. You're in good shape. Li Bai said faintly with jealousy flashing in his eyes. All right, come on, I haven't eaten yet. Long Rishan said lightly. Long Rishan wants to play with me, who of you will form a team with him? Li Bai walked to the court and said to the nine people on the court. They looked at Long Rishan, but no one spoke. Forget it, singled out. Long Rishan glanced at them and said lightly. Okay. Li Bai shrugged. The two walked into the field, and as one threw the ball high, the two jumped at the same time. However, Long Rishan's physique is not comparable to Li Bai, so he surpassed Li Bai in an instant and grabbed the ball. Boom! Long Rishan skillfully dribbled the ball and easily passed Li Bai's defense. All of a sudden, he reached the two point line, his slender legs bent slightly, and then he jumped. At the same time, his fingers suddenly exerted force, and the basketball flew to the basket. Boom! The net goes up and the ball goes in. Chapter 7 Wow, that's amazing! Really, people are handsome and basketball is good. With Long Rishan's handsome shot, all the girls around screamed. It's no wonder that they are like this. They are still high school students after graduation, and they are not yet adults, so their immunity to handsome guys is low. After scoring a goal, Long Rishan smiled at Lee Bai. Lee Bai was a little annoyed, took the ball and moved quickly. After making a few fake moves, he turned sideways and tried to flash past Long Rishan, but a slender hand stretched out from nowhere and slapped the ball away. Li Bai stopped and looked at Long Rishan in disbelief. Do you still want to fight? Long Rishan said lightly. Li Bai's expression changed, but he didn't speak. Ha ha. Long Rishan threw the ball high in the air and walked towards the cafeteria without even looking at the others. Just then, he stopped and looked ahead. A girl in a school uniform in front, with black hair, air bangs in front, a thin face with melon seeds, a pair of phoenix eyes, looks a little charming, and with thin lips, it is very delicate. Long Rishan's face changed, and then he continued to walk forward without speaking. It's impossible for us, Rishan. A clear voice came into his ears, which made him pause for a moment, then continued to walk forward and passed her. She is Li Ying. From childhood to adulthood, it can be said that she is a childhood sweetheart. Long Rishan likes her, and she also likes Long Rishan. When they got to high school, they were still in the same high school, but because of her appearance, many people in the school pursued her, and there were countless rich people, so the childhood sweethearts changed. There are often some men who come to block Long Rishan and warn him to stay away from Li Ying. Oh, cousin, he ignores you. At this moment, Li Bai came over and sneered. This is just right, so that people don't always think that our relationship is unclear. Li Ying said with an expressionless face. Hee hee, I really don't know what to do after the college entrance examination for this poor boy whose parents have died. It's none of my business if he's dead. Don't mention him in the future to save my boyfriend from being unhappy. Long Rishan didn't hear their conversation, and even if he heard it, he would ignore it. After dinner, he walked out of the school gate. A few minutes later, he came to an outdoor equipment store on the street. The world we are going to this time is the world of the Ming Dynasty, that is, the Ming Dynasty. The Ming Dynasty was established by Zhu Yu and Zhang and was the last unified dynasty established by the Han nationality in Chinese history. Beautiful boy, what do you want to buy? The things I have here are absolutely genuine, 
and there is no other store around. As soon as Long Rishan entered the store, a tall, bearded uncle came over and asked with a smile. There is only one outdoor store in this town, and there must be no other store that can compare. Long Rishan thought to himself. I'm going to explore a very dangerous place. Boss, please recommend it to me. Yang Hu looked at the student in school uniform in front of him with strange eyes, and asked curiously, where are you going to explore? Shen Nongjia. Long Rishan said lightly. Compared with Shen Nongjia, the Ming dynasty he was going to was similar in danger. Liang Zhe, listen to my advice, Shen Nongjia is too dangerous, it's best not to go. Yang Hu was also surprised when he heard about Shen Nongjia. He also often explores outdoors. Of course, he knew the dangers involved, so he said quickly. Thank you boss, I have already decided. Boss, please recommend me some good equipment. Long Rishan smiled and said firmly. Okay, you come with me. Seeing his expression, Yang Hu was silent for a few seconds before speaking to him. Chapter 8 Yang Hu took Long Rishan to a door, took out the key to open the door, and walked in. Come in. Yang Hu turned on the light and said softly. Long Rishan paused and walked in. The scene in front of him opened his eyes. There were rows and rows of wooden shelves. On the shelves, there were knives with a cold light. Some of them he had seen on TV, and there were also crossbows. This is my collection. I wouldn't sell it to ordinary people, but today I, Yang Hu, like you, so you can choose too. Yang Hu squinted his eyes and smiled. Long Rishan looked at the boss, walked to a Nepalese saber, held it lightly, and reflected his shadow on the face of the blade in the cold light. A little light. Long Rishan thought to himself, and then he put it back. Then he walked to a knife that was half a meter long and five centimeters wide. This is a machete, it is used for foot combat. It is the same as a common hand knife, except that it has a thick back, a sharp blade, a flat tip, not protruding forward, and a straight handle. Yang Hu said beside him. Hearing this, Long Rishan grabbed the machete, well, the weight is just right he thought to himself. Boss, how much is this? Long Rishan looked at him and asked. This is not for sale, promise me a request and I will give it to you. Yang Hu said with a smile. What request? Long Rishan asked in confusion. He didn't know this boss before, why did he ask him, could it be? Thinking of this, Long Rishan squeezed his legs involuntarily. If Yang Hu knew what he was thinking, he would definitely give him a knife. I want to go to Shenangjia with you. No. Long Rishan immediately shook his head and refused. Why? I also often explore and have rich experience. Yang Hu said suspiciously. I have my reasons. Boss, please make a price. Okay, just two thousand. Seeing his resolute expression, Yang Hu sighed. Well, how much is that plus the crossbow? Long Rishan set his sights on a wooden crossbow. This is a crossbow. The user must have strong arm strength, otherwise it will damage the arm. I'll charge you one thousand, and give you five crossbow arrows. It is good. Soon. Long Rishan came out with two boxes. In addition to the two weapons, there were some small knives and lighters, and a business card of Boss Yang. This son is a hidden dragon. Yang Hu looked at Long Rishan who was slowly walking away through the glass, and muttered. Long Rishan put his things at home and went to school. Soon, the afternoon class was over while studying. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt point, 1. Merit points, 0.51. Repayment, 0 slash 10,000, term, 19 days. Lo Wu World, Ming Dynasty, debt point 1. Jo World, not opened. Mythical World, the return of the great sage of journey to the west, merit points, 10. Mission, none. Items, none. Tomorrow, I'm here. 
Long Rishan was wearing light sportswear, with a military belt on his body, a machete pinned to his back, and a large backpack on his back. To enter the world of the Ming dynasty, one dead point is required, is it certain? Yes. Deduct one dead point start teleporting. I saw a flash of white light in the room, and Long Rishan disappeared in place. During the Jiajing period of the Ming dynasty, there were frequent famines and wars. In the winter of the 39th year of Jiajing, there was no snow in the winter, and on the 29th day of the 12th lunar month, Zhou Yunyi, the head of the Kintian prison, was sentenced by the court and sentenced to the East Factory for admonishing that the court's expenditures were excessive, the government was greedy for ink, the people were unhappy, and the sky was angry and the people were resentful. The eunuch Feng Bao was beaten to death outside the Meridian Gate. At this time, outside the capital, in a forest near the horse road, a dazzling white light flashed. Fortunately no one saw it. Long Rishan looked at the surrounding trees and breathed a sigh of relief. Ding! The task was released successfully, please check it yourself. A metallic sound appeared in his mind. Chapter 9 Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Points, 0 Merit Points, 0 0.51 Repayment, 0 slash 10,000, Term 19 days. Lo Wu World, Ming Dynasty, Debt Point 1. Jo World, Not Opened. Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10. Debt Collection Task, Ask Yan Song to return 10,000 tails of gold, the same treasure can also be used, Reward, 100 tails of gold, 1 Debt Point, Time, None. Side quest, survive the capital for one month, reward, you can bring an item back to the real world, except for living beings. Items, none. Yan Song, the only chief assistant in the history of the Ming dynasty who has been in control of the cabinet for twenty years, the head of the traitor? Let me accept his account. Isn't that courting death? Long Rishan scolded his father in his heart, this task is no different from courting death. He is also a person who has read history. Even if this is the world of film and television, it is a little different from reality, but it is not too big. Forget it, think of a way to survive here first. Long Rishan glanced at it and saw the main road. Since it was daytime, there were more carriages. Then he walked to the main road. But his clothes made those who drove carts and horses turn their heads to watch and at this time Long Rishan realized the feeling of a 100% return rate. After walking for a few minutes, he saw the tall city wall, and there was a group of soldiers stationed under the city gate, and everyone who came in and out had to read it. This made Long Rishan stop. He didn't know if he could bring a weapon in. If he couldn't, he might be arrested. The current Ming dynasty is a period of war. After hesitating for a while, he fell into the woods next to him again. Find a way to get in. When he was thinking about how to get in, he suddenly saw a middle-aged man in a robe fertilizing the tree in front of him, and suddenly thought of a way. Then he sneaked over. People on TV will faint if they are knocked on the neck, so how hard should I use? If the force is too low, it will be discovered if they are not knocked out, so try harder. Long Rishan thought to himself. I'm sorry big brother, I'll lend you some clothes. He meditated to the middle-aged man, and then slashed with a knife. Boom. As the faucet stopped, the middle-aged man fell to the ground. Gollum. Long Rishan swallowed nervously, then took off the middle-aged man's clothes. Ming Dynasty clothes have buttons, unlike the scholar's robe, which is divided into tops and bottoms, so it is easier to take off. Um. Long Rishan stopped and put his hand nervously on the middle-aged man's left chest. No no heartbeat. He sat on the ground in fright, took a few steps back, and murmured in a panic. I killed. I killed. Long Rishan was panicked and at a loss. As a senior in high school, he had never injured anyone, but now he actually killed someone, 
which made him not afraid. After a while, he didn't panic so much, but he was still very nervous, gritted his teeth, slowly approached the middle-aged man, and continued to take off his clothes. A few minutes later, Long Rishan finished changing his clothes, stuffed his clothes into the bag, and put the knife in the bag and carried it behind him. Then pretended to be calm and walked towards the city gate. Stop, what's in your bag? A soldier called to him. Sure enough, it was stopped. Long Rishan's heart tightened, but he still held up a smiling face and looked at the soldier. My lord, this is a special product of our place. I want to come to the capital to sell some money and go back to marry a wife. Then he took out a pack of cigarettes and a lighter from his bag, took out one, and handed it to the soldier. The soldier glanced curiously, and involuntarily put it in his mouth, and Long Rishan helped light the fire. They were surprised to see that the lighter actually caught fire. The soldier took a sharp inhalation, and a fluttering feeling came, and a mouthful of smoke spewed out. Zhang San, why is there smoke coming out of your mouth? The soldiers beside him were surprised. It's okay, by the way, you can go and sell it well. Zhang San took the cigarette and lighter in Long Rishan's hand and said to him with a smile. Thank you, everyone. Long Rishan quickly thanked him and walked into the city. Zhang San, let me try. I also want. I want to try. Several soldiers flocked to Zhang San. Chapter 10 Walking on the lively street, Long Rishan praised him. It really is the capital. I didn't expect the ancient times to be more lively than the modern times. If there is no war, it would be good to live here. But to survive here, you have to have money. I don't know if there is a pawn shop here. Long Rishan thought for a while and stopped a passerby. Hello? Brother, may I ask where is the place to exchange money? A middle-aged man in a grey-white robe looked at Long Rishan's short hair and couldn't help but be a little curious. Turn right 50 meters ahead and walk another 100 meters. There is a street there. If you have any treasures, you can change it there, or you can set up a stall there. The middle-aged uncle said. Thank you brother. Long Rishan said gratefully. Ha ha little brother is too polite. He nodded to the middle-aged man, and then walked in the direction he said. After walking for two minutes, he came to this street. On the stone-paved street, there are stalls selling all kinds of things. Soon, he came to a store. Department store. Interesting, there is actually a department store here. The modern department store wouldn't have evolved from this store, right? Long Rishan looked at the store with curious eyes, and then walked in. It was like an ancient version of a supermarket, with rows of shelves with things he had never seen before. This guest officer, what do you need? A middle-aged fat man in a gorgeous Tsing Yi came over and asked with a smile. Are you the boss? Long Rishan asked with a smile. I'm the shopkeeper here. The middle-aged fat man smiled. Do you take anything here? Except, of course, I don't know what the guest officer is going to sell. Fatty Lee looked at this short-haired young man, and his eyesight for many years would not be wrong. This is not an ordinary person, so the things he took out would not be ordinary. Sure enough, Long Rishan took out a 5 centimeter sized lighter with glittering gold. Guest officer, what is this? Fatty Lee looked at this thing with golden eyes, it was too delicate the patterns, colors, and stripes on it were never seen before. This is a very magical thing, there is only one in the world, you can make a price. Sure enough, the ancients were very curious about this thing, the more delicate it is, the more valuable it is, Long Rishan thought to himself. Guest officer, this thing looks good, but it's not made of gold after all. I can only give you 100 tails of silver which is the highest price. Fatty Lee thought for a moment and said seriously. Treasurer, 100 tails of silver is too little. I'll go to another house like this. It's not just your family. Long Rishan said with a smile. Guest officer, let's see, 
150 tails of silver is very high. Fatty Lee gritted his teeth and said distressedly. The corners of Long Rishan's mouth raised slightly. What about adding that? Only a crisp sound was heard, and a bunch of flames spewed from the lighter. This, this thing still breathes fire. Fatty Lee suddenly felt his breathing speed up. How is it? I'll give you one last chance. If I'm not satisfied with the price, I'll go to another place. Fatty Lee stared at the lighter, lost in thought. After a while, he looked at Long Rishan. Little brother, I will give you a maximum of ten tails of gold, if you can't do it, forget it. Fatty Lee said through gritted teeth. Seeing this fat shopkeeper like this, Long Rishan also knew that this was the limit, he couldn't help but sigh in his heart, but at the same time he was very happy. Twelve Liang is one kilogram, five hundred grams per kilogram, two or three hundred yuan per gram, which is hundreds of thousands. Okay, this is the price. Long Rishan's words made Fatty Lee smile. Okay, I'll go get the money now. The huge figure flew inside like the wind, and after a while, he came out with an exquisite purse. Little brother, take a look. Fatty Lee handed him the purse. Long Rishan opened the purse and looked at the small gold ingots, which were exactly ten, and couldn't help being a little excited. Correct. Then he gave the lighter to Fatty Lee. By the way, the shopkeeper, let me ask you something. Say it, little brother. Fatty Lee played with this delicate lighter and said happily. Chapter 11 Lying on the big bed made of mahogany, Long Rishan felt at ease for a while. He asked manager Lee, Yan Song has always been in the capital, the tallest and largest house in the east of the capital is his, and the Yan mansion is there. It is said that it is even better than the palace. But it was heavily guarded inside, so he didn't know how to start. Forget it, I'll go to explore the wind tomorrow and go to bed first. The next day, a ray of sunlight shone into the room, bringing a touch of warmth to the cold room. Ah, so comfortable, even more comfortable than my own bed. Long Rishan stretched, patted the bed padded with fur, and turned over to get up. It's a pity that I can't brush my teeth. Alas, I don't know if the time here is the same as reality. If it is the same, it will be troublesome, and the college entrance examination must have been missed. Host, please rest assured, after entering another world, the time in the real world will stop, but the lifespan of the host will also pass with the passage of time in this world. The sound of system metal sounded in his mind. That's good. He breathed a sigh of relief, and he didn't care about this month's lifespan. Then he left the room and went downstairs. Little ER, order. Come on. What do you want to eat? I just received a fresh roe deer today. Would you like to try it? Okay. Another pot of bar. Okay, please wait a moment, guest, it will be soon. Long Rishan, who had never tasted soju, blushed instantly after eating a bowl. Soon, he finished eating, left a piece of silver, and left the inn. Through the general direction and asking for directions, I finally found the Yan Mansion. The Yan Mansion was bigger than he imagined, and the long walls could not see the edge. How much money did Yan Song embezzle? This mansion is too big. Long Rishan muttered to himself. Then he walked along the wall for a while, and then he saw the gate. There were about twenty soldiers standing in rows at the gate. Mud, it's too much, Yan Song wants to do this, and arranges so many soldiers to guard in the capital. But he was only complaining. He also knew that Yan Song was the head of the treacherous officials, and his power in the court was even more than one person and ten thousand people. Even Emperor Jiajing was afraid of three points. He was also afraid that someone would assassinate him, so he should be more the troops are also normal. Then he walked around the wall for two hours. He was a little tired even because of his strong physique, but fortunately he found something. In the back, there was a small door, only two soldiers guarded, and he also saw someone bring food in. 
so he guessed it was a backyard kitchen or something. After guarding for a few hours, he found that only the food delivery people came in and out, and no one came in and out again, and it was a little dark, so he had no choice but to go back to the inn. The next day, Long Rishan went downstairs to eat as usual, but found that many people were talking about things. Did you know? The Yan Mansion is recruiting book boys. I heard that the daughter of the young Prime Minister Yan Shifan is recruiting book boys. Blessed are those scholars now. I'm so envious, why didn't I study in the first place? Come on, even if you study, you won't be able to enter the Yan Mansion just because of your looks. That's better than your pockmarked face. Hearing this, Long Rishan walked over. Brothers, you're talking about the schoolboy recruiting from the Yan Mansion? Are there any conditions? This. The middle-aged men stopped immediately, looked at each other, and looked at the fair and delicate short-haired guy in front of them without knowing what to say. Hee <laughs> hee, little E.R., I invited these eldest brothers to eat today. Long Rishan said to little E.R. with a smile. Ha ha ha, little brother is really refreshing. It's like this, the little prime minister's daughter is twelve years old and needs to study, so she is recruiting at the gate of the Yan mansion. There are no conditions, except that she can't be ugly. Thank you brother. Long Rishan bowed his hands to them and went out. Long Rishan had heard of Yan Chifan, and the titles of Great Prime Minister and Little Prime Minister were circulated throughout the court and the public. Great Prime Minister refers to Yan Song, and Little Prime Minister refers to Yan Song's only son, Yan Chifan. Chapter 12 At this time, it was very lively outside the Yan Mansion. A group of people watched from a distance around the gate of Yan Mansion, and some people lined up to sign up. Please let it go, let it go. Long Rishan slowly pushed aside the crowd and walked in. I saw a large table at the door, and there were a few servants in green robes. After thinking about it, he was also at the back of the line. The thin and thin scholars shook their heads and sighed and walked back, it seemed that they were unsuccessful. Soon, the morning passed, and people slowly dispersed. Next. Then the people in front of Long Rishan left disappointed and came to him. How old are you? Asked a servant who did not grow taller. I'm seventeen years old. Long Rishan smiled. What will you order? I can sing, I can write poetry, I can do math, and I won't talk about many more. Then let's come to the first three-character scripture. No need, just him as my book boy. At this moment, a delicate and pleasant voice came and I saw a little girl with a height of one meter and three walked out of the house, pinching her waist and saying, Miss, how did you come out? Just leave this to us. The servants laughed. You guys? When you grow up like this, whoever you pick out can be so good, it's just him. The little girl exclaimed coquettishly. Yes yes yes. They didn't dare to contradict this little princess. They had to know that the Prime Minister only had this precious granddaughter. If she said a few words in front of the Prime Minister, they would all be doomed. Brother, what's your name? I'll take you to get your clothes now. The housekeeper said to Long Rishan with a smile. My name is Long Yi, and I hope my elder brother will take care of him. Long Rishan pretended to be happy and smiled. It's easy to talk, just call me Brother Li. The family patted his shoulder happily. Yes, Brother Li. More than half a month passed quickly, and Long Rishan was completely familiar with the Yan Mansion, because the little princess Yan Mei took him around every day and asked him to tell stories. At night, the night is dark and windy. After all the lights went out, Long Rishan on the bed suddenly opened his eyes, then quickly changed into night clothes, took the knife and walked out of the room lightly. Afterwards, he skillfully avoided the patrolling soldiers and came to the largest house in the Yan Mansion. At this time, the house was pitch black, and there was no sound at all. Long Rishan looked around vigilantly, and after confirming that no one was there, he gently inserted the knife into the crack of the door, and then lifted it slowly. Boom! 
A voice that could not be more small sounded in this silent night, but it was covered by the sound of insects. Long Rishan opened the door carefully, caught the door stick that hadn't fallen yet, and then closed the door. Then lightly walked to the inner room. He had been here before and knew where Yan Song slept, and when his back was wet with cold sweat, he came to the bedside. There were two white figures lying on the bed, one was a bearded old man and the other was a girl in her twenties. It's really fun, this old guy really knows how to play. Long Rishan, an inexperienced junior brother, saw this piece of white flowers, and his breathing was a little short, and he thought enviously. But he didn't forget what it was for. Then both hands moved at the same time, covering Yan Song's mouth with one hand, and knocking on the girl's neck with the other. Um. Yan Song woke up instantly, but the girl fainted. Don't move around, or it will be bad if you accidentally touch you. Long Rishan quickly held the knife against his neck, pretending to be hoarse and cold. What do you want, you can't get out of here even if you kill me. Yan Song deserves to be a figure below one person and above ten thousand people, but he regained his composure in just a moment. I'm just, I'm here to collect debts. Long Rishan said coldly. He just wanted to say that he was only seeking money, but a message came from the system, saying that the task of robbery was not completed, and the debtor must be told that the repayment was successful. I don't know how much hero do you want? Yan Song said softly, but his eyes flashed with murderous intent. Not much, just ten thousand tails of gold. Long Rishan said softly. Ten thousand tails, although the old man has it but he is not here, or if you wait here, the old man will ask someone to fetch it. Don't play with me, or you'll go to hell. Long Rishan tightened his hands, and a bloodstain appeared on Yan Song's neck. Chapter 13 The hero will wait, I suddenly remembered that this room is there. Yan Song said nervously as a cold sweat fell on his face. He has been in a high position for so long, but he doesn't want to die. He has as much money as he wants. Then best, get up for me. Long Rishan's face under the black cloth raised a smile. Yan Song, who was being held by the knife, slowly got up, revealing Chiguo's body. Tisk tisk tisk, it's so small. Looking at the soft one centimeter, Long Rishan couldn't help laughing. Ha ha. Although Yan Song scolded her mother in her heart, she had a stiff smile on her face. Yan Song didn't even wear clothes, walked to a lamp, and then twisted. Squeak. The floor two meters away from him immediately separated, and a passage appeared. It's in here. Long Rishan nodded, and the two walked in. Five minutes later, Long Rishan narrowed his eyes, his face full of smiles. I saw that in front of him, boxes were placed on the ground and there were twenty boxes, all of which were opened by him. Pieces of gold ingots lay on it, glowing. As for Yan Song, he had already knocked him unconscious to the ground. System, you won't let me carry these boxes back, will you? Long Rishan said. No, the host only needs to put his hand on the gold, and the system will automatically recycle it. The sound of the system's metal sounded in his mind. Oh oh. Long Rishan put his hand down on the gold, only the white light flashed, and the box of gold disappeared. Then boxes of gold were collected by the system, and when he received ten boxes, a voice from the system interrupted him. Ding! Let Yan Song return the ten thousand tails of gold to complete the task. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Point, 1 Merit Points 0.51. Repayment, 0 slash 10,000, term, 19 days. Lo Wu World, Ming Dynasty, debt point 1. Jo World, not opened. Mythical World, the return of the great sage of journey to the west, merit points, 10. Debt collection task, ask Yan Song to return 10,000 tails of gold, the same treasure can also be used, reward. 100 tails of gold, 1 debt point, time, none. 
completed. Side quest, survive the capital for one month, reward, you can bring an item back to the real world, except for living beings. System, can I take this gold with me? Long Rishan looked at the gold, his eyes a little hot. No. The system's words made Long Rishan a little disappointed, but the system's next sentence made him laugh. The system can recycle gold. For every 100 tails of gold recovered, the host can get one tail of gold. Although you look like a vampire, I like it. Then Long Rishan began to quickly put away the gold, and soon, the secret room became empty, leaving only two people. Ding! Ten thousand tails of gold were recovered, and the host got one hundred tails of gold, which has been stored in the system inventory. A screen appeared in front of him. Item, gold two hundred tails, convertible. System, what does convertible mean? Long Rishan asked suspiciously. The host can convert gold into various currencies, including RMB, the system explained. The system, it saves me from selling gold. Long Rishan's eyes narrowed. Then he turned his gaze to Yan Song on the ground. Kill him or kill him. Long Rishan thought to himself. If he doesn't kill him, there may be some trouble when he wakes up. After hesitating for a moment, he gritted his teeth and slashed the knife through Yan Song's throat. Puff. A fountain of blood spewed. Moments later, a flame of fire rose in the room. Long Rishan also returned to his room, destroyed everything, and then went to sleep. For a time, the entire capital began to be turbulent, and the number of patrolling soldiers on the street increased several times. The court was even more lively, and Emperor Jiajing was even more in the limelight for a while. But this is none of Long Rishan's business. Soon, it will be a month and his task of surviving for a month has been completed. With a flash of white light, Long Rishan disappeared into the world of Daming. Chapter 14 In the room, a white light flashed, and Long Rishan appeared beside the bed. Finally home. Looking at the familiar bed, he couldn't help but miss it for a while. Then he changed into his clothes and took a hot shower. Super Debt Collection System Host Long Rishan. Debt point, 1. Merit points, 0.51. Repayment, 0 slash 10,000, term, 19 days. Lo Wu World, Ming Dynasty, debt point 1. Jo World, not opened. Mythical World, the return of the great sage of journey to the west, merit points, 10. Mission, none. Item. 200 tails of gold, you really. System, exchange gold for RMB for me. One gram of gold is exchanged for 250 RMB, do you want to confirm? The system prompts. That's not right, isn't the price of gold outside 301 gram? The price of gold outside should be counted as labor costs, not the system. Uh, okay, then change it for me. Long Rishan said speechlessly. The exchange was successful and it has been deposited into the host bank account. At the same time a message appeared on the phone. Zanya Bank your account ending in 7717 deposited 250.0000 yuan on May 9, and the current balance is 250.6300 yuan. I became a millionaire all of a sudden, ha ha ha, this money came so easily. So, he fell asleep that night, looking at the message on his phone with a smirk. The next day, he washed up with big dark circles under his eyes and went to school. Long Rishan, didn't you sleep well last night? A gust of fragrant wind entered Long Rishan's nose, causing him to turn his head to look. I saw a girl in a snow-white short dress standing behind him, with a fair face, a height of 165, and a small waist that was gripped by Ying Ying, plus the exposed white calves, all of which showed youthful beauty. Breath. Mu Shuaying. Is there something wrong? Long Rishan asked curiously. It's okay, sorry about what happened last time. Mu Shuaying said to him with a slight smile. 
It's all over. Long Rishan shook his head and didn't want to mention it. In the distance, two boys in school uniforms saw this scene. Zhang Xing, go and tell Zhao Xiao, this kid is in contact with the school girl again, and I'm here to stare at them. The other boy nodded and ran away quickly. Long Rishan and the others chatted while walking, and soon arrived at the playground. At this time, the two boys appeared just now, and there was an angry young man in front of them. Boy, I didn't beat you up last time, didn't you? You still dare to touch Lao Tzu's woman. While Zhao Yu said these words, his fists quickly swung towards him. Long Rishan's eyes turned cold, he raised his left hand, grabbed the swung fist, and then quickly kicked out with his right foot. Boom! I saw Zhao Yu groaning in pain, kneeling down while clutching his stomach. Don't go too far! Long Rishan said coldly. What are you still looking at, go to me, and I will be responsible for the injury. Zhao Yu roared angrily, but he was backing away. Stop, you all stop, Zhao Yu! Mu Shuang Jiao shouted at the side. But they didn't stop, and the two boys rushed towards Long Rishan. Bang, bang! With two muffled sounds, the two figures flew out, lying on the ground and wailing. Zhao Xiao, I didn't touch your woman, I'm not interested in her, don't bother me in the future. Long Rishan walked up to Zhao Yu and said lightly. And Mu Shuang, who was on the side, blushed instantly when she heard this. My mother said that she is also the school flower of Kintang High School. The people chasing me line up nine streets, you actually said that you are not interested. Long Rishan, I remember you. Mu Shuang murmured through gritted teeth. Zhao Yu, on the other hand, looked at his background with a grim expression, his hands clenched into fists, and his blue veins burst out. I won't let you go, the college entrance examination. You don't want to participate. Zhao Yu cried frantically. Shuang, did that kid treat you well? Then Zhao Yu said to Mu Shuang with a smile that he thought was charming as if he had forgotten what happened just now. Sorry, we don't know each other well. Also, please call me by my full name. Mu Shuang glanced at him lightly, ignoring his feelings, and then walked towards the classroom. Mud, stinky watch purple, sooner or later you will step over to me. Zhao Yu cursed in his heart. Chapter 15 Long Rishan returned to the classroom and waited for class. After a while, Yang Yuying walked in, wearing a white skirt, which made the male students in the class swallow their saliva and couldn't open their eyes. The female classmate, however, looked down at the one who looked at her, and then looked at the teacher in the stands, she couldn't help but feel sad. Okay, classmates. Yang Yuying turned a blind eye to these eyes and shouted with a smile. Hello teacher. A wolf howled loudly and the boy's voice was particularly loud. Long Rishan was used to the state of their group of wolves. Whenever Yang Yuying took a class, they turned from pigs to wolves. Be quiet, it's not good to be noisy in the next class. Yang Yuying said with a smile, so charming that the little boys below were almost drooling. Is teacher. Come on, let's start class now. Yang Yuying nodded and picked up the book. At this moment, a figure came to the door with a face as black as charcoal, as if someone owed him millions. Long Rishan, come out. Li Gong Gong shouted loudly, with the meaning of thunder hidden in his voice. What happened to Long Rishan? Looking at Eunuch Li, there must be something important. Hey, there's a good show to watch anyway. Some students began to whisper. And Zhao Kameng, who was sitting in the front row, turned around and glanced at Long Rishan. Seeing his indifferent appearance, he couldn't help but hate him even more. Humph, I don't know what bad things I did again. I was called by the head teacher. There must be no good things. Zhao Kameng pouted and thought a little angrily. She didn't know why, but when she saw his face, she got angry. Long Rishan glanced at the classmates who were gloating at the misfortune, and couldn't help but sneer. This is the so-called classmate. 
Then he walked out of the classroom. Zhao Kameng saw his tall and straight back, and instantly felt that he was not so annoying. Long Rishan, did you hit Zhao Yu and the other two classmates? Li Gong Gong asked loudly. Yes. Long Rishan did not deny it, but nodded lightly. I know your parents are gone and you're in a bad mood, but you shouldn't hit your classmates, you know? Not to mention, you hit Zhao Yu. He has now reported to the principal, what about you in the college entrance examination? Li Gong Gong said angrily. He wanted to hit me first, I can't stand there and let him hit. Long Rishan said lightly. Although the head teacher's tone was not good, he heard the head teacher's concern for him, and his heart warmed. It's useless to say these things now. You may be expelled from the school, but I will try my best to help you win. Go back to class first. Li Gong Gong said with his eyes closed and his hands waving. Thank you, teacher. Long Rishan nodded gratefully, and then walked into the classroom. Okay, let's go to class. Yang Yuying smiled and nodded at him, and then said. And the students around are also curious, what the class teacher told him. And Zhao Kameng was also looking at him with curious eyes. But Long Rishan only looked at the podium. After class was over soon, Li Gong Gong came to call him to the office again. Long Rishan, the school's decision has come out. I want you to apologize to classmate Zhao Yu, and then pay a thousand yuan and take the college entrance examination next year. The other is, dismissal. Li Gong Gong sighed. Thank you, teacher. I choose to fire. Long Rishan said with a slight smile. Long Rishan, why don't you take the college entrance examination next year? Go and apologize. Li Gong Gong advised. No, I know that you are doing my best, teacher, but I did nothing wrong and I won't apologize. Oh, okay. Mr. Li, what's the matter? How did Long Rishan get fired? At this moment, Yang Yuying pushed open the door and walked in. Long Rishan, you are here too. Hello, teacher Yang. Long Rishan called out politely. Mr. Yang, it's like this. Then Li Gong Gong explained the matter again. It's too much. Even if Long Rishan is at fault, he shouldn't be fired. I'll go to the principal. Yang Yuying walked out angrily. Chapter 16 At noon, Long Rishan was called by Yang Yuying. Long Rishan, I'm sorry, the teacher didn't help you. Mr. Yang, you're right, why did you say sorry to me? It's okay. Long Rishan shook his head and said softly. Well, you go home and rest for a few days, and the teacher will help you to ask other schools, we can transfer. Yang Yuying looked at him with big watery eyes and said. Okay. Soon, he completed the withdrawal procedures, and when he returned to the classroom to pack up, he looked at him with strange eyes. And Zhao Kameng also frowned, why did he drop out of school? It wasn't until the next day that I found out that it turned out that he beat Zhao Yu and the three of them dropped out. Other classmates are talking bad about him, but Zhao Kameng knows that Zhao Yu is worse than Long Rishan, how could Long Rishan beat him for no reason? There must be a story in it. At home, Long Rishan turned on the system after eating his own cooked rice. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Point, 1 Merit points, 0.51. Repayment, 0 slash 10,000, term, 17 days. Lo Wu World, Ming Dynasty, debt point 1. Jo World, not opened. Mythical World, the return of the great sage of journey to the west, merit points, 10. Mission, none. Item, Jade Ruyi. Seeing that there are more than two million in his bank card, after thinking about it, he decided to pay back the money to the system. Repay 10,000 yuan, are you sure? Yes. Successful repayment, get one debt point. Then Long Rishan looked at the system again and found that the amount had increased by ten times. Super Debt Collection System Host, 
Long Rishan. Debt Points, 2. Merit Points, 0.51. Repayment, 0 slash 1000000, Term, 1 Month. Lo Wu World, Ming Dynasty, Debt Point 1. Jo World, Not Opened. Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10. Mission, None. Item, Jade Ruyi. Repay 100,000, are you sure? Yes. Successful repayment, one debt point. Then two messages came from the phone. Long Rishan took a look at the system, and sure enough, the repayment amount had become one million. He thought about it and decided not to repay it first. Now he has three debts and decides to open another world. Host, Spend two debt points to randomly open the intermediate world in the low martial world. Intermediate low martial arts world? What is it like? There will be hot weapons or martial arts in the intermediate and low level martial arts world. The system explained. The worlds of the Ming dynasty now have nothing good except for gold and silver treasures. Well, the system opens the middle level low martial world. Randomly open the intermediate and low martial arts world, are you sure? Yes. Deduct two debt points and start teleporting. On a green prairie, there is a beautiful blue sky and white clouds, and there are animals playing on the grassland. And there is a river next to the grassland. At this moment, a white light flashed, and a figure appeared beside the river. Ding! The world of pleasant goat and big big wolf is open. The task was released successfully, please check it yourself. Is this the Ching Ching Prairie? It's really beautiful. Long Rishan didn't expect that he actually crossed into the animation world, still Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf. He has also seen this cartoon before, and if he likes whoever is in it, he can't help but say that it is Big Wolf, because Big Big Wolf is a genius, and he has the spirit of perseverance. The most important thing is that he is very kind to his family. I don't know what the mission is. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Point, 1 Merit Points, 0.51 Repayment, 0 slash 1 million, Term, 2 Months Low Martial World, Ming Dynasty, Debt Point 1 Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf, Debt Point 2 J.O. World, Not Opened Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10 Mission, Debt Collection Mission, Let Big Wolf Return 5 Drops of Undying Blood, Pseudo Time, None, Reward, 2 Debt Points 1 Drop of Undead Blood Side Quest, Help Big Wolf Complete the First Kill, Eating Sheep for the First Time Reward a set of grey wolf armor. Item, Jade Ruyi. Chapter 17 System, What is Undead Blood? Long Rishan asked curiously. In this world, there is a darling of the heavens, he is the grey wolf, and his blood is the blood of immortality. He will not die in this world unless the host kills him. But the system does not recommend the host to do this. The system explained. Why? Long Rishan asked suspiciously. If the host kills him, Tiendao here may discover the existence of the system, and the system will fall asleep again. What will happen to me if the system falls asleep? Long Rishan asked with a frown. The host will be obliterated. All right. Long Rishan no longer struggled with this issue. He would not kill Hui Tailang, nor was he a murderer. What is this, it's so strange. It's completely different from us. Voices came into Long Rishan's ears and woke him up. I saw animals surrounding him and pointed at him with fluffy fingers. Hi everybody. Long Rishan greeted them with a smile. This thing actually speaks. Yes, and it's quite tall, even taller than Mr. Bag. MMMM, why don't we find Lord Bag? Yet. Yeah. Hearing their words, Long Rishan's forehead was covered with black lines, and he was speechless. Lambs, the big wolf king is here. 
At this moment, a demonic voice came. Ah, run, the big grey wolf is coming. In an instant, the animals that were still full just now jumped around. Squeak! A grey shadow rushed over quickly, raising a wave of dust, and then abruptly stopped in front of Long Rishan. I saw a pair of strong and powerful claws gripping the ground tightly, with two slender legs on the claws, and a round belly on the legs, and then a cute face with a hat on his head. Although there is a scar on this face, it is so cute in Long Rishan's eyes. Hey, what's here? Why haven't I seen it in Ching Ching grassland before? Grey Wolf walked into Long Rishan curiously, and poked his sharp claws on his stomach. Grey Wolf, I'm human. Long Rishan said with a smile. Human? Never heard of it, how do you know the name of my big wolf king? Grey Wolf clenched his fist and waved, grinning his teeth and asking. The name Grey Wolf King has spread throughout our human world, don't you know? Long Rishan laughed. Ha ha ha, is my big wolf king already so famous? Yes, I'm handsome and a genius, so it's normal to be famous. Grey Wolf raised his paws and laughed, very happy. But Big Wolf, you don't seem to have eaten mutton, do you? Long Rishan's words made Hwe Tae Lang froze, and his face darkened. Who said that, I'll go catch the lamb now? The Big Grey Wolf shouted at Long Rishan, and then ran towards the grassland. Hey, wait for me. Long Rishan hurriedly shouted, his task was all on Big Wolf, he couldn't let him run away. But how could he be able to catch up with Big Big Wolf? Big 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 Wolf disappeared all of a sudden. He could only chase in this direction. After half an hour, he saw Yankin, and he also saw Big Wolf chasing sheep in Yankin. I'm going, how did the Big Grey Wolf get into the sheep village? Long Rishan was surprised to see the battle in Yankin, and he was very shocked. Although he has watched the cartoons and knows that the Big Wolf is very capable, he can even pass through the defensive gates with strong electric current, but seeing it in reality is another matter. Boom! A sudden loud noise pulled him back from his trance. I saw a black shadow falling from the sky and smashing in front of him. Cough cough! Lambs, I will definitely come back. After the dark grey wolf opened his eyes and said this, he fainted. Long Rishan saw a few lambs in Yank and holding gun barrels, like pleasant goats, and knew what was going on. Helpless, he had no choice but to grab Big Wolf's feet and drag him away from Yankin. Chapter 18 Beside a small river, Long Rishan lay helplessly on the ground, next to Big Big Wolf. It's night now, and he didn't bring anything to eat, he brought a knife, so he's hungry and thirsty now. In addition, Grey Wolf was still dizzy, making him extremely helpless. Ouch! It hurts the king, damn lamb! At this time, the big grey wolf woke up and screamed immediately. Stop screaming, hurry up and get me something to eat. Long Rishan gave him a roll of eyes and shouted. Hey, why are you still here? Not going home. Big wolf cried in surprise. Go back to you uncle, I saved you, but I haven't eaten yet. He looked at grey wolf with sad eyes. No wonder, I said why are you here, so you saved me. Let's go, this king will take you home. Grey Wolf also walked over, grabbed his feet and dragged him. Stop. I'll go by myself. Long Rishan shouted nervously, Sister, this Grey Wolf wouldn't know that I dragged him here, right? After this play, one man and one wolf returned to a magnificent castle. How is it, people? This is the king's castle. Big Wolf said proudly. Very good, it's just a little darker, it would be better if it were a little brighter. Long Rishan looked at the dark castle inside, like a ghost castle. It's easy, look at me. I saw the big grey wolf turned into a gust of wind and rushed into a room with a painted skull, followed by a ding ding dong dong sound. Very successful. It's done, ha ha ha. I saw Grey Wolf come out, his face dirty but with a smile on his face, and he was holding a metal ball in his hand with small holes in it. Grey, too, 
Wolf. At this moment, a sharp scream swept over, and then a black shadow flew over. Boom! Grey Wolf was instantly stunned, and a frying pan fell to the ground. Then the Red Wolf in the red coat came out with a frying pan in his hand. What are you? The Red Wolf looked at Long Rishan with vigilant eyes. Wife! At this time, the Grey Wolf woke up and shouted at the Red Wolf. Husband, where's the sheep? Big Wolf's awakening made Red Wolf shift his target. The sheep, are still being raised in the sheep village. Big Big Wolf lowered his head and whispered. You didn't catch the sheep and you came back, bang! The Red Wolf screamed, and another frying pan flew over. This time Grey Wolf didn't faint, but there was a big bag on his head. Red Wolf, stop hitting him, I'm the Grey Wolf who invited you to catch the sheep. At this time, Long Rishan said. You? My husband is so powerful that he can't catch it, can you catch it? Red Taelang looked at him with disbelief. Of course, in our world, sheep are eaten by us, and no sheep can escape our knife. Long Rishan started cheating Dafa. Although in reality, sheep are kept in captivity, but he has never killed a sheep, only ate mutton. Real. Hearing this, the Red Wolf immediately glowed with golden eyes and looked at him with respect. Of course. Long Rishan nodded with a smile. Grey Wolf, come over to greet the guests. Red Wolf shouted. Yes, wife. Big Wolf walked over and carried a chair over, then went into the kitchen and came out with a piece of cake. Come, man, this is grass cake, try it. Grey Wolf smiled and said, a small fang is exposed, which is very cute. Don't call me a man, call me Rishan. When Long Rishan heard the word person, he was wearing goosebumps, so he couldn't get used to it. But he still took the cake and took a bite. Hey? Why is it so delicious? Long Rishan couldn't help being startled, he couldn't help but closed his eyes, it felt like he was in the middle of nature, in the prairie under the blue sky and white clouds, the fresh breath came to him. Is it that delicious? The grey wolf and the red wolf asked suspiciously. Our world eats a lot of meat, and it's rare to eat something as refreshing as this. Long Rishan said without swallowing the cake in his mouth. Meat? Hearing the meat, Big Wolf and Big Red immediately drooled. Chapter 19 Don't worry, I came here to let you eat meat. Long Rishan licked his lips after eating the last bit of cake. This sentence made them both very happy, as if the sheep had reached their mouths. By the way, Grey Wolf, what is this steel ball you just made? Long Rishan turned his attention to the steel ball in Grey Wolf's hand. Rishan, this is a floating star light, as long as you press this button, it will automatically fly up, you see. I saw Grey Wolf press a small red dot protruding from the floating star lamp with his claws, and then the floating star lamp slowly rose, rising into the air, and a series of colored lights shot out from those small holes, shooting into the sky. On the wall, a starry sky is formed. Wow! Husband, it's so beautiful! Wife. The two wolves hugged together, and Long Rishan felt so beautiful. It would be even better if there was meat. Said the red wolf in a low voice. This voice made Grey Wolf's body stiffen, and he turned his gaze to Long Rishan, making him numb with hopeful eyes. The next day, Long Rishan was pulled up by the wolf early in the morning, saying that the wolf who got up early had the sheep to eat. Rishan, hurry, hurry the lambs probably haven't gotten up yet, just went in and caught them all. Long Rishan, who was pulled by the grey wolf with two panda eyes, ran fast with great energy. Grey wolf, it's only five o'clock, and the sun hasn't come out yet, so please let me sleep for a while. Long Rishan said weakly, yawning. No, the lamb in the daytime is too cunning. Big big wolf said as he ran. Okay, okay. Long Rishan was speechless. After an hour, they came to the gate of the sheep village. Rishan, come, let's get over there. Grey Wolf said cautiously. Don't. He looked at Big Big Wolf with disgust. 
he was a human, so how could he drill? Then how do we get in? You hide next to me first, look at me. Long Rishan pushed him away, and said as if I was the eldest brother. Okay. Grey Wolf obediently hid in the grass on the side. After seeing it, Long Rishan nodded with satisfaction, and then rang the doorbell at the gate of Yankin. Ding, ding. As a huge bell rang, the sheep in Yankin were woken up one after another. Who is it, who came to Yankin in the morning? Pleasant Yang Yang rubbed his eyes, got up, and walked out. Who, don't you know that the lack of sleep in sheep is very serious? Lazy Yang Yang cursed, and then fell asleep again. I hate it again, so that everyone can't sleep beautifully. This is the beautiful sheep. Then more and more sheep came out and walked to the gate of the sheep village. Hello, do you need anything? Although Pleasant Goat didn't understand what kind of creature was in front of him, he still asked politely. I came from the far south to see the smartest animals here. Long Rishan said with a smile. Since it is a guest, of course our sheep clan welcomes you, come and open the door. I saw the slow sheep walking out and said with a smile. On the other hand, Big Big Wolf looked at this scene with admiration on his face, and let the sheep open the door in one sentence, which was amazing. Squeak! I saw the dark boiling sheep open the door. Long Rishan nodded to the sheep and went in. When the lambs were not prepared, they took out the machete and put it on the neck of the boiled sheep. Grey Wolf, come out! Long Rishan smiled faintly. Guest, what are you doing? Slow Yang Yang said with a frown. Why, of course I'm arresting you, ha 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 ha, the king is here. I saw the big grey wolf jumping out violently and said with a wicked smile. Rishan, it's really amazing. Grey wolf raised his claws at long Rishan and smiled happily. Let's go, just catch this strong one. Aren't you going to catch two more? Grey wolf said suspiciously. Keep it for now there will be more opportunities in the future. Long Rishan said lightly. Yes, ha ha ha, lambs, wait. Grey Wolf laughed. Then, pressing boiling Yang Yang, he walked out of Yankin and walked towards Wolfsburg. Leaving a flock of angry lambs behind. Chatper 20 Wife, we're back. Big Wolf shouted as soon as he entered the door. Husband. Red Wolf walked out. Ah, little sheep, my husband is amazing. Seeing the fainted boiling Yang Yang, the Red Wolf was so excited that he gave the Grey Wolf a sweet kiss. This is all due to Rishan. I didn't even do anything, the sheep was caught. Big Wolf laughed. Okay, don't talk too much, let's kill the sheep first, maybe they will come to rescue the boiling sheep later. Long Rishan said with a smile. Yes, kill the sheep first, wife, I'll boil the water first. Big Wolf shouted excitedly, then ran to boil the water. When Long Rishan saw Big Wolf's operation, he couldn't help but be speechless for a while. He only boiled the sheep every time, wouldn't he kill it before cooking it? Forget it, let me kill it. If the pleasant goats come, I don't know what will happen. He took out a machete and slashed at boiling Yang Yang. Puff! A blood spring spewed out, and the boiling sheep was silent. Seeing the blood again, he was still a little uncomfortable and a little nauseated. Suddenly, a slightly uneasy feeling came over me. Grey Wolf, come first. This unease made him decide to finish the task first. What's the matter, Rishan, this king is still boiling water. Big Big Wolf ran over and laughed. Grey Wolf, give me five drops of your blood. Long Rishan said. What are you coming for? Grey Wolf asked suspiciously. Don't worry about it, give it to me, he said solemnly, frowning. Oh, good. The Grey Wolf was frightened by him like this, and then cut the skin with his claws, and blood flowed out, and he quickly caught it with his hands. Grey Wolf, you said that the blood was returned to me, hurry up. Long Rishan said anxiously. Although he didn't understand why he said this, 
Big Wolf said it anyway. These blood were returned to Rishan by this king. As a prompt sounded, Long Rishan breathed a sigh of relief. Are you all right? Grey Wolf asked cautiously. Okay, let's cook it. He pointed to the bleeding sheep and said. It is good. Then Big Big Wolf ran to the cauldron with the corpse of boiling sheep, threw it down, and then added the ingredients. After half an hour, a burst of scent hits my face. But Long Rishan was talking to himself. Am I feeling wrong? He frowned. Wife, Rishan, come and eat mutton. Come on. Long Rishan looked up, and saw Big Wolf secretly put a piece of mutton into his mouth. At this time, his uneasiness reached the extreme. No, system, send me back. I saw a flash of white light, and Long Rishan disappeared into the Yang Yang world. At this time, things did not stop. After Grey Wolf ate this piece of mutton, a bloody red flashed in his eyes, and then his pupils were slowly filled with blood, two fangs quickly grew, and the cartoon's body quickly swelled. Roar! A huge beast roar came from the mouth of the big grey wolf, and at the same time the castle was slowly bursting. Husband, husband, what's wrong with you, don't scare me. I saw the red wolf screaming in panic below. Kin grey wolf can't hear. Boom! A loud bang sounded, and the wolf fort turned into rubble and flew everywhere, and a 30 meter high wolf appeared at the location of the wolf fort. Village chief, what is that? The lazy sheep shouted. No, the big grey wolf ate the meat of the boiling sheep and sheep, and his bloodiness was stimulated. He told all the animals on the Ching Ching grassland to run quickly. The slow sheep screamed in horror. The escape of the animals has begun, and the sheep world has ushered in a disaster. And Long Rishan, who has returned to his house, doesn't know what happened in the Yang Yang world. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan. Debt Point, 1. Merit Points, 0.51. Repayment, 0 slash 1 million, term, 2 months. Low Martial World, Ming Dynasty, Debt Point 1, Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf, Debt Point 10. Jooa World, Not Opened. Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10. Mission, Debt Collection Mission, Let Big Wolf Return 5 Drops of Undying Blood, Pseudo. Time, None, Reward, 2. Debt Points 1 Drop of Undead Blood. Completed. Side quest, help Big Wolf complete the first kill, eating sheep for the first time. Reward, a set of Grey Wolf armor. Completed. Item, Jade Ruyi. Chapter 21 System, why did the debt points required to enter the world of Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf become 10 points? Long Rishan asked in surprise. Because this world has mutated into a pseudo-high martial world, the system explained. What is the pseudo-high martial arts world? He asked curiously. The pseudo-high martial arts world only refers to the strength of individual creatures in this world, reaching the strength of the high martial arts world, while the rest is the strength of the low martial arts world. Said the system. So it is. Long Rishan nodded. Then he received the mission reward. Super Debt Collection System. Host, Long Rishan. Debt points, 3. Merit points, 0.51. Repayment, 0 slash 1 million, term, 2 months. Low Martial World, Ming Dynasty, debt point 1, Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf, debt point 10. Jooa World, not opened. Mythical World, the return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, merit points, 10. Mission, None. Items, Jade Ruyi, Pseudo, Immortal Blood, and a set of Grey Wolf brand armor. System, How do you use this undead blood? Oral. As a thin invisible white light flashed, a blood red bead appeared in front of the eyes, and there were also halos circulating on it. If Long Rishan had not known that it was blood, he might have thought it was pearls. 
Then he swallowed the undead blood. I just felt a heat flow quickly dissipating from my body, and then my whole body became warm, as if I had never used up my strength. Hey? The system doesn't seem to have changed. Long Rishan asked curiously. The main effect of this, pseudo, undead blood is to enhance people's self-healing ability, said the system. Isn't this the same as Wolverine? Long Rishan asked curiously. Yes. Hearing the system's words, he couldn't help but be more curious, how powerful this is, and made him want to try it. Then he took out a knife and put it in his palm. Crack. At this moment, the door was opened. Little Tim. No. I saw a man in his thirties walk in. It seemed that Long Rishan put the knife in his hand and was about to cut it, which made the man pale and rushed over to knock out his knife. Uncle, why are you here? Long Rishan asked curiously. Are you doing something stupid if I don't come? Although your parents are gone, don't you still have your uncle and aunt? Why can't you think about it, you child? The uncle cursed in pain. Uncle, I don't want to commit suicide. Long Rishan looked at the knife and knew that he had misunderstood what he meant, and said with a wry smile. You didn't commit suicide, you put the knife in your hand. The uncle obviously didn't believe it. Uh. Uncle, say you have something to do here. It was impossible for Long Rishan to let him know the truth, so he changed the subject. It's not been a long time since my uncle saw you. I miss you. Aunt is also nagging you all day long, so I came to see you, and at the same time to see if you are free, go to my uncle's house for a meal. Uncle said slowly. Looking at his uncle, Long Rishan couldn't help but be moved. My uncle is from Wangxiang town next to Kintang town. He is a fisherman and has a daughter, but he is the same as his own. The same is true of his aunt, who is very kind to him. Grandpa is still in the village, let's go see him tomorrow. Long Rishan thought to himself. Uncle, I'm free. He then spoke to his uncle. It's good to have time, let's go, go home. I also took this knife. The uncle stood up with the machete. Don't say it, this knife is quite beautiful. When Long Rishan heard his uncle muttering to himself, the corners of his mouth twitched a little, can a knife worth 2,000 yuan look bad? Then he got on his uncle's motorcycle and slowly disappeared into the street. Twenty minutes later. They stopped in front of a two-story house. Wife, I've brought Xiao Tian back, let's cook quickly, and also got the hairy crabs I called back this morning. Uncle shouted at the door. Xiao Tian is here, let my aunt take a look. Oh, I've lost weight, haven't I eaten well? A woman in her thirties came out, saw Long Rishan and ran over, pulling him to look around. Come and cook. Uncle urged. Little Tim, go inside and sit for a while. Auntie will cook something for you. It will be ready soon. After speaking, he walked into the kitchen in a hurry. Chapter 22 Long Rishan felt the love of his aunt and the others for him, and a mist of water appeared in his eyes. He knew that the living conditions of his uncle's house were not good, and he had to support a daughter to go to high school, so the expenses were also high. And the hairy crabs sold outside are at least a few dozen yuan, and the big ones are several hundred yuan. My uncle is fishing, and it is impossible to take two small ones home. That is to say, the meal that my aunt cooks now costs several hundred yuan. Xiao Tian, sit inside for a while. Xiao Qi is out of class today. I'll take her back. Uncle said softly. Okay, uncle, let's go. Um. With a rumbling sound, a black smoke from the motorcycle slowly disappeared. Xiaoqi is the daughter of her uncle, her full name is Liang Qi. She is now in the first year of high school and is two years younger than him. Long Rishan went inside and sat. Uncle's house is not good. There is no sofa, only some wooden chairs, but there are others. After an hour. When a voice sounded, I knew that my uncle was back. Brother Tim. 
a petite figure quickly appeared from the door and rushed towards him. Boom! Immediately it hung on him. Xiao Qi, you're so old, are you still holding your brother like this? Long Rishan hugged Xiao Qi in his arms with a bitter smile. He he, I like it, I won't give it. A delicate little face was revealed, and he smiled sweetly at him, with two small dimples on his face. Give, give. Long Rishan touched her hair with a wry smile, then held her on the chair. How is your study? Long Rishan asked casually. At this time, he carefully looked at the girl he hadn't seen for a long time, and found that he had grown up for the first time. The face with melon seeds was very delicate, and with the small dimples and big eyes, it can be said that the cuteness turned most people. With a height of only 1.57 meters, he was like a child with him, but it was still okay. And this figure is not bad, the drums are all bulging. The first age, how about it, okay? Zioki raised her head proudly and said proudly. Not bad. Are there any boys chasing you? Long Rishan raised his eyebrows and laughed. Of course there is, but I don't like it. Xiao Qi pouted. Oh? Why? There should be good boys too. When are they as handsome as brother Xiao Tian, when they are so good, I can think about it, he he. Xiao Qi narrowed her eyes and smiled. Ha ha ha, then they will never have a chance because no one is more handsome than me. Long Rishan laughed. You. Brother Xiao Tian, I didn't expect you to be so narcissistic. Xiao Qi said with a look of disgust. This is self-confidence. Long Rishan shook his hair and put on the most handsome look of me, which made Xiaoki laugh. Okay, just kidding, high school is not allowed to fall in love, you know. Long Rishan said seriously. I know, like my parents, I doubt whether you are their biological child. Xiao Qi muttered while pouting. Little girl, don't talk nonsense. Long R.I. added a jujube to the past. If you don't fall in love before college, how about I buy you the latest mobile phone and computer? He smiled. Brother Xiao Tian, do you still have money? Xiao Qi asked curiously. Brother's ability is beyond your imagination. Long Rishan pretended to force. Cut. Wash your hands and eat. Aunt's voice came from the kitchen. Come on, wash your hands and eat. Come on, Xiao Tian, eat more. Auntie put a piece of pork into his bowl and said softly. Aunt, I'll take it myself, and you can eat it too. Looking at the bowl of meat piled up in front of him. Long Rishan couldn't help saying quickly. Okay, Xiao Tian is more sensible, Xiaoki, learn more from brother, do you know? Auntie smiled happily, then looked at Xiao Qi who was working hard and said. Oh. Xiaoki responded weakly, then glared at him, as if to say, it's all your fault, I fell out of favor. Long Rishan also looked back without hesitation. No way. Handsome people are always treated differently. Humph. Zioki snorted softly, and then threw herself into eating again. Chapter 23 At night, he came home. It feels good to have someone who cares. Long Rishan lay in bed thinking, and then fell asleep. The next day, he got up early, went to the market to buy some vegetables and some tea, and then took the motorcycle back to the village. His hometown is in the countryside, not far from the town, only half an hour's drive, but because he had to go to school, he didn't go back to the village to live, so there was only his grandfather in the village. Grandpa is 70 years old this year, but in good health, he can still work in the fields, growing vegetables and peanuts. Soon, he arrived at the village. The village is close to the sea and the air is very fresh. It has developed rapidly in recent years, so the roads are all cement roads now. A three-story building 200 meters away from the village entrance is his hometown. Grandpa, I'm back. Long Rishan shouted as he walked into the door. Xiao Tian, is that Xiao Tian? A voice came from the second floor, 
and then an old and thin figure walked down the stairs. Grandfather. He quickly walked over to hold his grandfather's hand. Grandpa was sleeping just now, Xiao Tian, did you eat? Grandpa will cook for you. Grandpa grabbed his hand tightly and said happily. Grandpa, sit down, I'll cook, and I've bought vegetables. Long Rishan looked at the bloodshot eyes of his grandfather, his nose sour, and said quickly. Okay, that grandpa is blessed, ha ha ha. Then Long Rishan helped his grandfather to sit down, and then took the dishes into the kitchen. Half an hour later, the two grandfathers and grandsons sat at the dining table to eat. Grandpa, shall I come back to take care of you? Looking at his grandfather's thinner face than before, Long Rishan couldn't help but say. Since my parents left, my grandfather hasn't slept well. It's no wonder that he is thin by himself. Silly child, you still have to go to school. Grandpa is not old yet, so he can take care of himself. Grandpa squinted and smiled. But. It's nothing to worry about. Study hard and get admitted to a good university. Grandpa will be happy. Long Rishan lowered his head. It was impossible for him to tell his grandpa that he was expelled from the school, otherwise he would definitely not be able to bear it. Got it, Grandpa. Soon, at night, Grandpa did not keep him, but drove him back. When he got home, he lay in bed thinking. I don't have to go to class now. I still have more than two million yuan. Should I do some business? Of course, the more money, the better. What kind of business is good? Long Rishan suddenly thought of the cake he ate in Wolfsburg. If only I could do that. The grass cake was so delicious that he still had an unforgettable aftertaste. Ding! The host can spend one dead point to exchange for the recipe for the grass cake, are you sure? What? Can you still exchange recipes? Long Rishan exclaimed in surprise. Yes, as long as the world has been opened, the contents in it can be exchanged. The system explained. Doesn't that mean that I can exchange the golden hoop? He was excited when he thought that the golden hoop could become bigger and smaller. The 1000 points of merit required to exchange the golden hoop rod. What is merit? Long Rishan asked curiously. Merald is the result of doing good deeds, and God rewards hard work. People with great merit will have great luck. All right. Seeing his 0.51 merit, he felt powerless for a while. Then I thought of the herbal formula. He still has three dead points and if redeemed, there are two dead points left. After thinking for a while, he still decided to exchange, making money is important. Although he can enter the world and make money faster than this, he can't explain to others where the money comes from, which is why he doesn't tell his uncles that he has money. Consume one dead point to exchange for the recipe of grass cake, are you sure? Yes. As the voice fell, a memory flashed in his mind. Chapter 24 It turns out that it can be made with vegetables, and people who don't have a formula can't make that feeling, so I don't have to worry about other people's copycats. Long Rishan said a little excitedly. Find out what you need to open a store first. Then he opened Duniang. It turns out that so many things are needed to open a store such as business licenses, health permits and health certificates, and must also register with the tax bureau to pay taxes and receive invoices. Looking at what was said on the phone, he couldn't help but sigh, the business is not doing well. But I'm not 18 years old, so I can't get a business license. Another problem stumped him. He is only 17 years old and will not turn 18 until February next year. At this time, the phone rang. Looking at the phone, it turned out to be Yang Yuying. Hey, Teacher Yang, is something wrong? Long Rishan, the teacher asked for you, Zhang Cheng No. 1 High School can let you turn over, would you like to? Yang Yuying's sweet voice sounded in his ear. Yes, thank you teacher. Long Rishan immediately said gratefully. No thanks, this is what the teacher should do. 
then you come to school tomorrow. Okay, teacher, I see. Well, then you should rest early, good night. Good night. Next day. He came to school. When he was on the playground, he stopped and looked at a man and a woman in front of him, it was Zhao Yu and Mu Shuaying. Seeing Zhao Yu, Long Rishan felt a surge of anger in his heart. It was he who asked the school to expel him, and he was not a gentleman if he didn't get his revenge. Yo, isn't this Long Rishan who was expelled? How did he enter our school? He didn't come over the wall, right? Zhao Yu stopped attacking Mu Shuaying and mocked him when he saw him. Are you playing less? Long Rishan said lightly to Zhao Yu without even looking at Mu Shuaying. Oh, I'm so scared. Zhao Yu hugged his arms and shrank, as if he was really scared, but his face was disgusting. Mu Shuaying also looked at Zhao Yu with disgust. She hates this Zhao Yu very much, pesters her every day like a fly. If it hadn't been for others to know that she was Lala's business, she would have slapped her in the past. Ha ha. Long Rishan walked up to him, grabbed his neck, and lifted him up with one hand. Cough cough, let go, let go. Zhao Yu clasped his hand tightly with both hands, trying to open it, but he didn't move. Soon, Zhao Yu's face turned red, and his feet were no longer able to pedal. Long Rishan let him go, it will kill people. Seeing Zhao Yu like this, Mu Shuaying couldn't help crying. Don't be too arrogant, or you won't know how to die another day. After Long Rishan said this lightly, he threw him out with a force of his hand. Boom! Zhao Yu was thrown onto the lawn and rolled in a circle, but it was no big deal. His neck was only a little red, and it subsided quickly. Long Rishan controlled the strength. After all, he didn't want to drink tea. Zhao Yu stood up slowly, did not speak, looked at him with a grim look, but there was a trace of fear in the bottom of his eyes, and he didn't even notice it himself. You are kind of out of school. Zhao Yu put down a cruel word, and then ran towards the school gate, even Mu Shuaying couldn't care about it. Go away, he will bring people to block you. Mu Shuaying worried. Just block it. Long Rishan left this sentence and left without even looking at her. You. Mu Shuaying stomped her feet. After all, she is also a schoolgirl, and she doesn't even look at her. Humph, I'll give it up, Miss Ben doesn't believe it, and I'll take care of you if I don't do it. Mu Shuaying said through gritted teeth. At this time, Long Rishan has come to the office. Ji Tian is here, sit down. Yang Yuying smiled at him. His teacher. Rishan, I'll take you to go through the transfer procedures later. You can go to Zhancheng High School to go through the admission procedures. The teacher has already greeted the vice principal of Zhancheng High School, and he will arrange everything when you go there. Thank you teacher. Long Rishan thanked. Yes, let's go, go through the transfer procedures first. With the help of Yang Yuying, the formalities were quickly completed. From now on, his student status is no longer from Kintang High School. In the future, this incident made Kintang High School a joke in the field of education. Chapter 25 It was already dusk, the heat was slowly dissipating, and the students slowly walked out of the classroom. Sitting on the steps next to the runway, Long Rishan looked at those former classmates and couldn't help feeling a little emotional. There are too many facts that happened during this time. In just one week, he has made so much money, and he has also experienced death and killed people. Sometimes he also wonders if he is still degenerate if there is no system. Hey! Long Rishan? Why is he here? When Zhao Kameng walked through the playground with a girl, she suddenly saw Long Rishan sitting there in a daze, a little curious. Mao Mao, go back first, I have something to do. Zhao Kameng turned to the girl beside him. Okay, then I'll go first, bye. The girl nodded. Bye bye. After seeing his best friend leave, Zhao Kameng walked to Long Rishan. Hey, why are you here? 
Long Rishan turned to look at her, come here to go through the transfer procedures. Where are you going? She asked curiously. Zhang Cheng No. 1 High School. Long Rishan said, looking at the crowd in the distance. Oh. Of course she knew about Zhang Cheng No. 1 High School, a key high school. A minute passed and neither of them spoke. Long Rishan, didn't you see a beautiful girl beside you? Even if I don't like you, you can show it, really. Zhao Kameng scolded Long Rishan secretly in her heart, her little hands clenched tightly, it was really cute. She didn't know why it was like this, and it stands to reason that she hated him. Aren't you going home yet? Long Rishan's sudden voice startled Zhao Kameng. Oh, back. Zhao Kameng stood up blankly, and was about to leave. I'll invite you to dinner. Long Rishan said looking at her watery eyes. Ah, no. No need. When Zhao Kameng met his charming eyes, she couldn't help blushing and waved quickly. Let's go, last time you took care of me in the hospital, I haven't thanked you yet. Having said that, Long Rishan stood up by himself, hooked his trouser pockets with both hands, and walked towards the school gate. Oh oh! Zhao Kameng followed involuntarily. Long Rishan, you are finally out. As soon as I got out of the school gate, I saw five people gathered around, four of them with colorful hair, wearing jeans and leather jackets, and holding steel pipes in their hands. However, Zhao Yu looked at him from behind the four. Long Rishan, who are they? Zhao Kameng hid behind him in fright and asked nervously. It's just a pile of rubbish, you should step back and finish it soon. Long Rishan patted her shoulder and said softly. Let's call the security. Zhao Kameng said nervously. If the security guards were useful, they would have come out by now. Long Rishan glanced at Zhao Yu and said coldly. Retreat first, wait for me, soon. Well, then be careful. Zhao Kameng gritted his teeth and retreated into the distance. Boy, is your girlfriend? You look good, how about lending your brother a few to play with and letting you go? A silver smile with bright yellow hair said. It depends on whether you have this ability. A cold light flashed in Long Rishan's eyes, and he said coldly. Boy, I really don't see blood and don't cry. Give it to me. Huang Mao shouted for a while, smashing the steel pipe in his hand to his head. But Long Rishan was faster than him, and his right foot slammed into Huang Mao's stomach. Bang! Huang Mao flew out at a very fast speed and fell to the ground. But Long Rishan didn't stop, and he knocked down the two thugs with another horizontal kick, and the last punch hit the red hair on the right. What? In less than ten seconds, the four stray hairs fell to the ground and wailed. You, don't come here. Zhao Yu was panicked. He didn't expect that he would be able to fight four in one hit, and he would still kill in one second. Don't worry, I won't be stupid enough to touch you here, but you'll have to be careful in the future. Long Rishan walked up to him, patted his face, and said coldly. He was really angry. He targeted him once or twice, and the Buddha was on fire, let alone him. Come on, let's go eat. Said to Zhao Kameng with a smile. Oh oh. Obviously, she hasn't recovered from what just happened. Chapter 26 In a restaurant not far from the school. You can order whatever you want. Long Rishan put the menu in front of her. Is it expensive to eat here? Zhao Kameng asked in a low voice. It's okay, I brought enough money. Long Rishan smiled lightly. All right. Zhao Kameng turned over the menu. Wow, this stir-fried vegetable is only 20 yuan, and I can't finish the food that I bought at home for 2 yuan. And chili fried pork, it costs 38. Surprised voices came from her, causing everyone who was eating around to look at them with curiosity and disdain in their eyes. At this time, Zhao Kameng also found that everyone was looking at her, and couldn't help blushing to the bottom of her ears, she was really cute. It's okay. Just order it if you want. Long Rishan smiled lightly, 
not caring about other people's eyes at all. He doesn't rely on his eyes to eat. If he always cares about other people's eyes, he will be very tired. Long Rishan, why don't we eat at another restaurant? It's too expensive. Zhao Kameng looked at him softly and said. He shook his head, took the menu from her hand, and then said to the waiter. Take one of the seven most expensive dishes in your place, and another soup. What do you want to drink? Long Rishan looked at her. Orange juice is fine. Okay, then two glasses of orange juice, freshly squeezed, don't add water to me, or don't blame me for complaining to you, that's all. After a series of words, Long Rishan handed the menu to the waiter. Okay, please wait a moment. I'll place an order for you now." The waitress nodded and backed off. Zhao Kameng looked at him from the side, and exclaimed in his heart, how domineering. You don't have to be under so much pressure when you say I'm treating you. Long Rishan looked at her with a smile and said. All right. Soon, the dishes came up. Seeing these fragrant dishes, Zhao Kameng gulped wildly. Her family is not good. She has never eaten such expensive food, and she only buys clothes once every few months. Eat. Long Rishan laughed. Okay. Then the two began to move chopsticks. Half an hour later, Zhao Kameng sat on the chair with her waist supported, motionless. It's all your fault. I ordered so many dishes to see what happened to my waist. She pointed to her stomach and said to Long Rishan. It's like a pregnant little pregnant woman. Long Rishan smiled slightly. You're pregnant. A blank eye flew over. Long Rishan felt electrocuted. Okay, we should go, it's getting late. Pay. After paying the order, Long Rishan sent her to the door before leaving. However, Zhao Kameng's impression of him has changed, and he doesn't seem to hate him anymore. And Long Rishan returned home. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Points, 2 Merit Points, 0.51 Repayment, 0 slash 1 million, Term, 1 month 27 days Low Martial World, Ming Dynasty, Debt Point 1, Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf, Debt Point 10 Joa World, Not Opened Mythical World the Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10. Mission, None. Items, A Set of Yuruyi and Big Wolf Brand Armor. Look at the Big Wolf Brand Armor, I haven't seen it for two days. Then he took out the armor. A white light flashed, and a set of silver armor appeared on his body. Long Rishan felt ten pounds heavier, but he could still bear it. In a second, the armor was dressed and even his face was wrapped, only a pair of eyes were exposed, but he didn't feel any breathing. The armor is silver all over, and the helmet looks like a wolf's head, which is very cool, and there is a sword behind him. The only bad thing is that in the middle of the breastplate there is a big grey wolf head with a slap. System, is this armor just for decoration? It's so light. Long Rishan asked curiously. This armor has a strong defense and can defend against missile attacks, and the sword is purely for looks. The system explained. Hearing the system's words, the corners of his mouth twitched, purely for the sake of the beautiful sword. However, this armor is also quite powerful. It can actually defend against missile attacks, so can't he walk sideways on the earth? Don't think too much about the host. The attack that can defend against missiles refers to physical attacks. If it is a shock attack, the host will be injured or even killed. The system instantly slapped its face. Chapter 27 All right all right. Long Rishan was not disappointed either. System, help me open a random world, the sum of two dead points but don't enter yet. Ding. Spend two dead points to randomly open the intermediate and low-level martial arts world, are you sure? Yes. Open successfully. Super Debt Collection System. Host, Long Rishan. Debt points, zero. Merit points, 
0.51. Repayment, 0 slash 1 million, term, 1 month 27 days. Low Martial World, Ming Dynasty, Debt Point 1, Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf, Debt Point 10, AM and Fenjiun 1, Accessible. JO World, Not Opened. Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10. Mission, None. Item, Jade Ruyi. AM and Fenjiun World? Then I can see Phage and Andy. Long Rishan was a little excited because his idols were Phage, Andy, and Little Sing Sing. And that little strong robot. By the way, let's see if you can put things into the system inventory. Yes, but the size of non-system items is less than 10 kilograms. In addition to real-world items, items from other worlds that enter the system inventory system will be automatically swallowed, and the corresponding money will be returned to the host except for system rewards. That's good. Then he put the crossbow in the system inventory, and also received some food and money in case of an accident. Enter the world of Omen. Ding, start teleporting. At night, Aemon, the city of gambling and feasting, is the only legal gambling place in the Dragon Kingdom, and it is very lively. Aemon Crown Casino is also a very famous casino in the world. In a toilet inside the casino, a white light flashed, and Long Rishan appeared in it. System, can you be more disgusting, twice out of four times in the toilet. Long Rishan couldn't help cursing when he saw the toilet. Don't worry, the host. Next time, the system will try to satisfy the host's requirements, and be more disgusting. Ding. The task was released successfully, please check it yourself. The mim of the system made him look as ugly as eating flies. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Points, 0 Merit Points, 0 0.51 Repayment, 0 slash 1 million, Term, 1 month 27 days Low Martial World, Ming Dynasty, Debt Point 1, Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf, Debt Point 10, AM and Fenjiun 1 Debt point 2. J.O. World, not opened. Mythical World, the return of the great sage of journey to the west, merit points, 10. Debt collection mission, magic hand stone is a smart chip that owes the system, please take it back from the host. Reward, 2. Debt points 1. Supercomputer chip. Side quest, help the police catch Mr. Gao ahead of time. Reward, 1 million RMB. Thing. System, you're not playing with me, are you? Brother Fa's chip has already been implanted in his finger. If you want to take it back, don't you want to chop off Brother Fa's finger? Long Rishan shouted. This is the host's business. If the host does not complete the task in one day, he cannot leave this world. The system said coldly. Long Rishan was a little crazy. He found that the system was getting more and more arrogant, and he talked more and more. But he couldn't do anything about the system, so he had to think of a way. He walked out of the toilet and into the hall. Wow, is this a casino? It's so big and luxurious. He looked left and right like a bumpkin entering the city, feeling very fresh. When he was about to go to the second floor, he was stopped. Sir, I'm sorry. The second floor is reserved, so I can't go up. Said a tall man wearing sunglasses. Oh, good. Long Rishan nodded, then walked away. I don't know if Phage has returned to Aemon now. If not, where can I find him? I don't have an American passport or an ID card. Long Rishan thought with a frown. Wait, this is, a cow must win. It's him. As long as you catch his line, you can see Brother Fa. Long Rishan looked at Niu Bishan who was flirting with his sister in the distance, and felt a little happy. Then he walked over. Brother Bishan, is it really you? Long Rishan patted Niu Bishan on the shoulder and pretended to be excited. Chapter 28 Who are you, pretty boy? Niu Bishan asked suspiciously. Haha, 
Brother Bishan definitely doesn't know me. How can someone who does big things like Brother Bishan know a small person like me? I'm just a person who worships Brother Bishan. Long Rishan opened his eyes and bragged with a blushing face. He felt disgusted by this flattering effort. Oh? So I'm so famous? Ha ha ha, are you trying to get an autograph? Neo Bishan really likes to be in the limelight, he likes to be praised, and most importantly, he likes to brag. No, no, I heard that Brother Bishan's gambling skills are very good, and even the magician Shi Yujian can draw a tie, so I want to make two moves with Brother Bishan. Long Rishan pretended to worship and said, Little brother, if your uncle hears what you say, he will rip you off, ha ha ha, but I like it, and I also think my gambling skills are better than him. Neo Bishan was so light-hearted by him that he laughed out loud. Let's go, let's go bet two games with uncle. Then take him to the second floor. This time the two security guards didn't stop him, and the two went straight up. Uncle, here I am, happy birthday, ha ha ha. As soon as Neo Bishan came up, he bowed his hands to Faji who was in the middle. You brat, why are you so late, you're almost here before the end. Faji turned around and asked with his signature smile. No, I just accepted an apprentice below and brought it to uncle for you to see. Neo Bishan said proudly. Since it's your apprentice, you must seal a big red envelope. I saw Brother Fa stood up from his chair, took out a big red envelope from his clothes, and stuffed it into his cell phone. Thank you, Brother Jian. Long Rishan was a little excited, seeing an idol, and receiving a red envelope. You can't be G, you see me so excited, I'm old, you go to your master, ha ha ha. Fa Ji's words made him blush. Go, uncle, don't spoil my precious apprentice. I also expect him to defeat your apprentice. Neo Bishan waved his hand quickly and looked at his uncle with disgust. Ha ha ha, he is a good talent, and he is still a blank paper, teach him well. Shi Yujian said with a big smile. I just said that I have good eyesight, even uncle, you said so. Neo Bishan said narcissistically, making Long Rishan on the side blushed. All right, all right, it's very late today. So let's end the banquet today. Then he and Neo Bishan left. In fact, according to the plot, Neo Bishan and Xiao Lang originally went to apprenticeship, and then saw Brother Jian's daughter ACAI, and then the killer chased him down. But Long Rishan changed the plot, that is, what happened after this is unknown. Long Rishan was lying on the bed. This was Neo Bishan's villa, but this one was given to him, and he went to the other one himself. A person who loves face like Neo Bishan will definitely not go to apprenticeship again, so tomorrow only Xiao Lang will go to apprenticeship by himself, and the killer will appear tomorrow night. If I'm just waiting, this will never get the job done, and it looks like it's time to take the initiative. It stands to reason that Mr. Gao should be in the DOA group now. He hasn't shot yet, so I'm not that strong in his sense of defense in the past. Thinking of this, Long Rishan jumped up, changed into a night suit, and disappeared into the night sky. An hour later, he stopped in front of the DOA group building, but the building was pitch black. I'm going, I'm so stupid, no one will go to work now. Long Rishan patted his head and said speechlessly. He had no choice but to go back to the villa. At five o'clock in the morning, he suddenly opened his eyes, and then ran out of the villa. Now the genius is slightly bright, so there are basically no pedestrians on the road. He was familiar with the road and quickly came to the building, which was guarded by security guards at this time. Sir, please come back at eight if you have an appointment. He walked there, and Bayazai stopped him. I didn't make an appointment, I just wanted to borrow your clothes. Then Long Rishan shot him to knock him unconscious, dragged him quickly to the grass beside him put on the security uniform, and took the elevator card at the same time. Chapter 29 At this time, someone came to work, but no one noticed that the security guard was not the same person. By 8 o'clock, there were two, 
and the security guard yawned to change the guard and let him go on patrol. Fortunately, his hat was low, and the two security guards were sleepy, so he couldn't see his appearance clearly. Taking this opportunity, Long Rishan hid a side door of the lobby and secretly stared in the direction of the door. At nine o'clock, Mr. Gao walked in with a few bodyguards, and then got into the elevator. After waiting for another five minutes, after confirming that they were going up, Long Rishan came out and walked into the elevator. But this building has 30 floors, and the security guard's elevator card can only be swiped to the 29th floor, and the last floor is only by stairs. In the elevator, he pointed out the armor in the inventory. With a flash of white light, the dress was completed. No, there is a man in armor who went up to the 29th floor, please inform the others. When the security guard in the monitoring room saw this scene, he immediately shouted on the walkie-talkie and sounded the alarm at the same time. Discovered. Long Rishan frowned, but he wasn't worried, he knew they had guns, but it was useless if they couldn't penetrate his armor. After getting out of the elevator, he quickly ran to the 30th floor. Catch him. Looking at the safety gate, he opened his bow and smashed his silver fist hard. Boom. The door was knocked down immediately, and the wall next to it shattered. But as soon as he got out of the 30th floor, he saw six bodyguards pointing guns at him. Bang bang bang. One after another fire flashed from the armor, and the bullets were all bounced off. Humph. Long Rishan rushed over and punched them. Boom. Puff. A bodyguard immediately vomited blood and fell to the ground twitching. Although this armor is heavy, it does not affect his flexibility. Then he grabbed a bodyguard and slammed it hard on the ground, and as the blood spurted, another couldn't move. The other four didn't dare to get close when they saw it, so they could only shoot him from a distance. Seeing them hiding so far, Long Rishan ignored them and walked to Mr. Gao's office. Bang! He kicked the door open, and saw Mr. Gao with a parachute on his back, opening the window, ready to jump down. Seeing the door being kicked open, he panicked immediately and jumped down suddenly. When Long Rishan saw him jump, he couldn't help rushing over and jumped down. At this moment, he seemed to hear the sound of his own heartbeat, the sound of his own blood flowing. At this moment, he regretted. But there is no regret medicine in the world, only good luck and luck, he is heavier than Mr. Gao, so he is faster than him, and hit the parachute all of a sudden. Boom! The two of them hit the ground hard. Thirty stories is too low. Fortunately, with the cushioning of the parachute, Long Rishan was not injured, but his chest was a little tight. Humph, I want to run. When Yu Guang saw that Mr. Gao wanted to run, he immediately flew over and kicked him. Ah! Mr. Gao was kicked and eaten by a dog, and his palms bleed instantly. Who are you, I can give you money if you want. Mr. Gao gritted his teeth and said slowly. I don't want money, I want your people. A hoarse voice came from the armor. Hearing the sound of the car, Long Rishan grabbed Mr. Gao and ran. Ten minutes later, he shook off everyone and entered a dilapidated factory building. Go ahead and tell all your sins. Long Rishan threw him on the ground and asked coldly. Are you Taizi? Mr. Gao asked calmly. Let's just say, do you want to find guilt? Long Rishan stepped on the solace of his feet and slowly exerted force. Ah! Mr. Gao cried out in pain. I won't tell you if you kill me. Mr. Gao said with red eyes and gritted teeth. Yes. Long Rishan took out a needle, grabbed his hand and stabbed his finger. What? A terrifying scream rang out, and a flock of birds flew away. Fingers crossed, that's right. Speak or not. Do not say. What? Asked every time a needle was inserted, but Mr. Gao was completely wet with cold sweat. Speak or not? Long Rishan asked again. Say, I said, say it to me. Mr. Gao twitched his palm, his expression distorted. Chapter 30 Ten minutes later, 
Long Rishan took back his armor and disappeared into the broken factory building. Leaving behind Mr. Gao, who was tied up, a voice recorder, and a mobile phone. The screen of the mobile phone was still on, and 110 was displayed on the screen. Half an hour later, more than a dozen police cars surrounded the factory. This is, evidence. Luo Xian, played by Jing Tian, exclaimed in surprise. Take the prisoner away and close the team. And the protagonist of this matter is on the way to Phage's villa. The side quest is completed, and in the end, Brother Fa is left. I hope Brother Fa can know how to do it, otherwise don't blame me. A hint of coldness flashed in Long Rishan's eyes. At noon, he came to Phage's villa, and the armor was already dressed. In the movie, there are many organs in this villa, and there is also Xiao Qiang, but I don't know if Xiao Qiang can launch energy attacks. Boom! Long Rishan opened the door, only everyone was here, Fa Ji, Xiao Leng, Niu Bishan, ACAI. Who is this, who actually broke into the house, I called the police. I saw Brother Fa stood up and said with a smile. Brother Jian, I'm here to find you. Long Rishan said in a hoarse voice. Oh, I don't know what you have to do with me. Are you playing Mahjong? Brother Fa asked with a smile on his face. Mr. Gao has been handed over to the police by me, so I'll ask Brother Jian to get a chip. That's none of my business, I don't have what you want. Brother Fa still smiled, but a hint of surprise flashed in the depths of his eyes. Brother Jian, you've already retired. You don't need the things you have, and even if you don't have that, your gambling skills are just as good, so why hold on to it? And, I'm not going to take that chip in or out of the casino, I can assure you. Long Rishan said lightly. He has already decided that if Brother Fa does not agree, he will grab it. Whoa, 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 dong dong dong. Cards of cards were bounced off the armor. It's like this. Then don't blame me for being rude. Long Rishan said coldly. Then he ran to Shi Yujian. Run away. Xiao Lang shouted, then took out the gun and shot him, but what he got was just a spark. How is that possible? They were all surprised. And when Long Rishan was leaning towards Shi Yujian, he made a turn, and the steel hand instantly grabbed ACAI's neck. Brother Jian, I don't want to hurt you so don't force me. Long Rishan decided to give them another chance, otherwise he would have to kill. Okay, I hope you can keep your promise. Fortunately, Brother Fa never insisted. I saw that he took a fruit knife from the side, and then picked it at the nail of the index finger of his right hand. Puff. A blood spurted out. Dad. Uncle. The other three cried out in concern. It's okay it's just a nail. Brother Fa smiled with a pale face. Then tossed the nails to Long Rishan. Long Rishan grabbed his fingernails, and as a reminder sounded in his mind, the corners of his mouth raised under the helmet. Finally completed the task, it's not easy. He thought to himself. You got the things, then bye bye. He let go of ACAI, then waved to them and walked out of the villa. Return. A white light flashed and disappeared in the world of Aemon. This is the fastest time to come back, except for the return of the great sage to the world. It's only one day. Long Rishan sighed. The great sage returns to the world and the host only comes back from death, the system added. You will die if you don't speak. Once disturbed by the system, the atmosphere disappeared completely. The system reminds the host here that as the host enters more and more worlds, the time difference between the real world and the other world will gradually overlap. The current time ratio is 3 to 1, and the world will pass after 3 days in the other world. One day. I'm going. Fortunately, I didn't stay for too long this time, otherwise I wouldn't be able to go to Zhancheng High School today. Looking at the sky outside, I found that it was already a little bright. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Points, 2 Merit Points, 
0.51. Repayment, 0 slash 1 million, term, 1 month and 26 days. Low Martial World, Ming Dynasty, Debt Point 1, Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf, Debt Point 10, AM and Fenjiun 1, Debt Point 2. Jo World, Not Opened. Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10. Mission, None. Items, Supercomputer Chips. What is a supercomputer chip? Forget it. Go and finish the entrance book first, or you will be scolded to death by Teacher Yang. Long Rishan went to wash up, then packed up the required materials, and went out. Chapter 31 At nine o'clock, he arrived at Zhang Cheng No. 1 High School. Looking at the tall school gate, he couldn't help but sigh, it is indeed the No. 1 High School, but it is luxurious. Then he walked in, and after asking someone, he quickly found the office of Vice Principal Yang. Dong Dong. Come in. Hello, Principal Yang, I'm Long Rishan. After Long Rishan walked in, he saw a middle aged man with glasses and shouted. You are Long Rishan, Yu Ying told me about your situation, you can rest assured to study here, this situation will never happen. Yang Zhang stood up and smiled. Thank you, Principal. Long Rishan said gratefully. Hey, don't call the principal, call the vice principal, otherwise the principal will be unhappy, ha ha ha. Yang Zhang laughed. Yes, vice chancellor. Okay, then I'll take you to go through the formalities first, and then I'll go to the classroom to have a look and get to know the new classmates. Then they went to the dean and went through the formalities. But when choosing whether to stay, he hesitated and chose to stay. Although he will often disappear, he also wants to meet more friends and does not want to be alone all the time. Besides, the college entrance examination is very soon, and there is a lot of time after the college entrance examination, which is not bad. Students, a new student was transferred to our class today, and everyone welcomed him with applause. In the classroom, the female head teacher said to the whole class with a smile. Clap clap clap. There was a burst of warm applause, and Long Rishan walked in. This classmate, let me introduce myself to everyone. The head teacher laughed. Long Rishan nodded to the head teacher, then looked at the more than 40 students below. Hello everyone, my name is Long Rishan. I like learning and fitness, and I know a little bit about various sports. I came to this class today. I hope everyone will take care of you. At the same time, you can talk to me if you need me to do it. Thank you. Clap clap clap. There was another round of applause. Okay, classmate Long, you can sit in the last seat first, and I will agree view first. The head teacher said to him. Okay. Then he walked to the last empty seat in the second row, next to a girl. She's not pretty, she can only be considered pretty, and her big black rimmed glasses lowered her score again. Hello, please take care of me. Long Rishan sat down, smiled at the girl, and said hello. Hello. The girl pushed her glasses and whispered. He saw that the girl's desk was full of review materials and workbooks, and he thought to himself that she was another student. But he's not a stallion and of course he doesn't flirt with girls, so he also took out his book and read it. Get out of class will be over soon. Many students gathered around. Handsome guy, where are you from? An ordinary boy asked. I'm from Kintang town. Long Rishan smiled. I've been there, and now the seaside is so beautiful that it has become a national tourist resort, and there are a lot of real estate and so on. A female student was surprised. Wow, so good. Yes, I really want to go. If you come to Kintang another day, I'll take you to play, including room and board. Long Rishan said with a smile. Wow, you're still a local tyrant. Ha ha ha, we can kill the local tyrants. Exactly. Many students joined in. Don't make trouble, classmate Long is an orphan. 
At this time, the female head teacher came over and said lightly. What? Everyone was stunned, and some girls suddenly felt that he was so pitiful, with some maternal love in their eyes. It's okay, the head teacher, I still have this money. The most important thing is that the students are happy. Long Rish and Yuguang took their expressions into his eyes and was very moved. Let's talk about it when the time comes. By the way, classmate Long, your dormitory is in 502, and Xiao Pang lives in 502. He will let him take you there. The head teacher pointed to a little fat man next to him who was 1.7 meters tall and 130 pounds. Old class, I'm strong, not fat. Little fatty shouted. Uh, ha 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 everyone sighed, and then laughed out loud. Chapter 32 After the morning class, he followed Xiao Peng and the other two boys back to the dormitory. 502 is on the fifth floor, there is no elevator, so take the stairs. After walking cleanly, they opened the door. Crack. Rishan, this is your bed, the bottom bunk is occupied by these two guys. Little Fatty said angrily. Little Fatty, I'm not afraid of you falling down while sleeping and pressing me, what are you afraid of? One of the boys laughed. Rishan, my name is Li Longhao. The one with glasses is Lu Xiaobang, who is said to be a descendant of Lu Bang. Li Longhao laughed. Oh. Long Rishan nodded. By getting to know him, he also knew a little bit about the three of them, all three of whom were a few months older than him. Xiaopang's full name is Zhang Daz Wang. He is from the countryside, but he is not strong. He is only fat, and he likes to eat but he always said confidently that he was a muscle. Li Longhao is a native of Zhang Cheng. His family has some assets, but he is a good person. He just likes to play games. His skills are comparable to that of professional players, so he now earns the money for school and living expenses by himself. Lu Xiaobang is from a rural area. He is a typical scholar, but he is very interested in internet computers, and he is also very talented. Now he earns the living expenses himself. Brothers, why don't we go have a meal and call the girl by the way? Li Longhao said softly. Why do I think this is the content? Little Fatty muttered. Do you want to rank again or something? Whoever is bigger is the boss. Lu Xiaobang pushed his glasses and said. Yeah, it's okay, then I'm the biggest here. I'll be the boss, Xiaopang's second child. Xiao Bang's third child, and Rishan's fourth child. It's such a happy decision. Li Longhao clapped his hands and smiled. We have no opinion. Long Rishan and Lu Xiao Bang looked at each other and said. I have an opinion. Little Fatty raised his hand. Second brother, do you have any opinions? If you have any opinions, we will talk about them after dinner. I will call the girl now. Second child, just admit it. Long Rishan walked up to Xiao Peng, patted him on the shoulder, and said lightly. Little Fatty turned his attention to Xiao Bang, and when he saw him nodded with a smile, he couldn't help lowering his head. Li Long Hao, I want to eat you up and let you make me the second child. Fatty whispered softly. However, Long Rishan's ear was very powerful, and when he heard this, he couldn't help but evoke a smile. It feels so good. Thai Lai Seafood Restaurant. Wow, boss, this place should be expensive, right? Xiao Pang swallowed as he looked at the decoration and the fish and shrimp in the seafood pond. At least a few dozen yuan per pound. But don't worry, this is what the boss invited you to. Li Longhao patted his shoulder and smiled. Yo, big brother. You are so generous, do your parents know? At this moment, a dangling voice came. Then a boy with red hair about 1.68 meters in his arms walked over with a girl who was dressed in a non-mainstream fashion. Li Longxian, what are you doing here? Li Longhao's expression changed immediately. Of course I'm here for dinner. Otherwise, how could I meet this generous big brother? Li Longxuan's pale lips raised in disdain. 
Humph, I don't need to let you know who I invite to dinner. Of course I don't need to know, but just don't use your family's money. Don't worry, I won't spend a penny at home. The second and third, the fourth, let's go to the second floor. Li Longhao said with a cold face. It is good. Then the four went to the second floor. Boss, what's going on? Long Rishan asked. Hey, my mother died a long time ago. Now this is my stepmother, and Li Longxian is the stepmother's son. My dad used to love me very much, but now, he he, he didn't even look at me. Li Longhao laughed. There are a few of our brothers, don't worry. Long Rishan said seriously, Xiao Peng and Xiao Bang also nodded. Yeah. Li Longhao nodded deeply. Ding. Just then his cell phone rang. It's Sissi and them. Hey, Sissi, are you here? We're on the second floor, yes, yes, bye. Then the five girls wore youthful short skirts and small white t-shirts, but they also showed their figures perfectly. Chapter 33 Sissi, here. Li Longhao raised his hand and shook it. Come on, sit down. They all helped the girls pull up chairs. As the girls sat down, Li Longhao started talking. The second, third, and fourth, this is my girlfriend, Feng Sisi. These are her best friends, don't say I don't create opportunities for you, ha ha ha. Hello, sister-in-law. The three of them shouted at the cute girl who was a little fat. Oh, don't listen to his nonsense. Feng Sisi said shyly. Ha ha ha, don't talk, let's order something to eat. Then Li Longhao and Sisi went to pick out seafood, leaving three men and four women staring at each other. I don't know if it's because of similarities or what, these four girls are all cute. Moreover, their eyes were dimly looking towards Long Rishan. No way, after the improvement of the N.I. Linko, he has a dusty temperament. And his skin is very white and very good, and he has a face that is as delicate as a knife. The eyes of a pair of double eyelids seem to reveal the light, as well as the tall nose and thin lips, making people unable to breathe. But because he didn't pay too much attention to his appearance, he didn't even know the slight beard on his chin. What's your name? A girl sitting opposite Long Rishan gritted her teeth and whispered. The other three girls were surprised and regretful for a while. My name is Long Rishan. He smiled slightly. Seeing the boy in front of him smile, the four girls couldn't help but their hearts beat faster. How handsome! They thought to themselves. It's done. Hey, why don't you talk? Li Longhao took Sisi's hand and came back, seeing that they were all quiet, and said suspiciously. We're making eye contact, you don't understand. Right, four beauties. Long Rishan smiled slightly. Exactly. Before the girl could answer, the two animals next to her spoke first. Are you two beautiful women? Long Rishan gave them a roll of eyes. Giggle cluck. This sentence made several girls laugh. Okay, let's introduce it. We are in class 3 and 8. This is the boss of our dormitory, Li Long Hao, the second child, Zhang Daz Wang, and the third child, Lu Xiao Bang. I just introduced them. Long Rishan said softly. My name is Zhao Xian, this is Lu Lingyun, Liang Ruyu, and Su Miao Miao, said the girl who spoke first. Then they also chatted, and the atmosphere got better and better. Soon the dishes came, and the plates of seafood caused them to move their index fingers, and then they began to eat with chopsticks. After eating for more than an hour, they were done. Originally, Long Rishan wanted to pay the bill, but Li Longhao said that this meal was his request, so he gave up. Since there was still class in the afternoon, it was already past one o'clock, so they hurriedly packed up and went to class. He spent the afternoon in a tense study atmosphere. After class, he took out his mobile phone and called his grandfather. Hey, Grandpa. It's Xiao Tian, what's the matter? Are you short of money? Grandpa asked someone to send it to you. 
Grandpa's old voice came from the phone and asked with concern. It's not that I'm short of money, Grandpa, I've transferred schools. Where are you going? Why didn't you tell Grandpa? Grandpa, I've transferred to Zhancheng No. 1 High School. It's better here. I only had class today, so I didn't have time to tell you. Okay, but the cost over there will be larger. Do you really need Grandpa to send you money? Since Grandpa was always concerned about whether he had money or not, the corners of his eyes were a little wet. Grandpa really doesn't need it. I rented out the house in the town, so I don't have any money to spend. He told a small lie. That's good, then take care of yourself over there. I know Grandpa, you should rest early. It is good. Fourth, do you want to eat chicken in a black box? Brother will take you to eat chicken. Li Longhao said to him as soon as he returned to the dormitory. I cannot play. He was a little stunned, he rarely played games. It's okay, brother will take you, the third guy is writing code again, don't worry about him. Li Longhao pulled him on the chair and helped him download the exciting battlefield of PUBG. Chapter 34 Fourth there is someone on the second floor of the blue house in front of you, do you see it? The boss's voice came. I see, I'll kill him. Long Rishan didn't move his head and replied, his eyes fixed on the screen. I saw him skillfully controlling the characters, holding a 9AK to aim and shoot, all in one go. Boom. The phone showed that the other party had been shot in the head and died. Good luck. Congratulations on eating chicken. As the screen turns, it returns to the initial interface. Wow, the fourth, you are so amazing, you've only played two games and you've eaten chicken, and said that you haven't played before. Fatty jumped up and ran to the bedside and said loudly. Ha ha ha, the talent is good. Long Rishan laughed. Come on, come on, let's go, said little Fatty. No. I have something to do tomorrow. He shook his head. What's the matter? They asked suspiciously. I want to buy a computer tomorrow, why don't you accompany me, I'm not familiar with this place. Long Rishan said. Okay, let's go with you, let's play another game? He <laughs> he. Li Longhao said. All right. Looking at their hopeful eyes, he nodded helplessly. The next day. It was Friday, and after class they drove to Meida Mall. Meida Shopping Center is the largest department store in Zhancheng, where everything can be sold, even snacks. Meida Mall is 20 stories high, and the computer is on the third floor. Hello, do you want to buy a computer? A beautiful female shopping guide asked them. Yes. Long Rishan nodded. Excuse me. What price do you want to buy? The pretty shopping guide didn't give them face because they were young people and didn't dress well. Which one of yours has the best performance? Sir, please come this way. The beauty shopping guide walked in front of the beautiful high heels. This is a laptop with better functions in all directions in our store, and it slides into the Honor Magic Book 14-inch thin and narrow bezel laptop. Can you turn it on and take a look? Long Rishan said lightly. Okay. Third, help me see how it goes. He smiled at Lu Xiaobang. Um. Lu Xiaobang came over, started the interview for a few minutes, and then nodded to Long Rishan. How much is this? This is the latest model. It costs 9,999 yuan and can be paid in installments. The beauty shopping guide smiled. If she sells one, the commission is also several hundred yuan. Fourth, do you have enough money? Not enough brothers to help you. Li Longhao said with a frown. If he could use his family's money, 10,000 yuan would not be expensive, but he can't use it now. Don't worry, this little money is still there. Long Rishan was very happy with their attitude. Do you want to buy it? I'll give it to you. He laughed. No need. Li Longhao and Xiao Pang shook their heads. They didn't pay much attention to computers. 
I want to buy it, but I don't have the money. Lu Xiaobang glanced at the notebook with eager eyes, then shook his head. We're brothers, it's normal to send you things. Long Rishan said. No. Just treat it as if I borrowed it from you, and I'll pay you back if I have the money. Lu Xiaobang said firmly. He really wanted this computer, but he wouldn't take it for nothing, otherwise he would be troubled. In addition, the old computer in the dormitory crashes from time to time, so I decided to buy one. Okay. The beauty will help me get to and swipe the card. Long Rishan took out the bank card and handed it to the beauty shopping guide. Okay, just a second. The beauty shopping guide took the card with a smile on her face. Wow. I didn't expect to be a little rich man, and a little fresh meat. The beauty shopping guide couldn't help but be surprised when she saw the amount of more than three million in the card. Looking at the handsome Long Rishan, she couldn't help but be obsessed. Beauty. Are you all right? Long Rishan waved to her and said. Ah. I'm sorry. Here's your computer and bank card, and a receipt. The beauty shopping guide hurriedly got everything ready and handed it over to him. After they were far away, the beauty shopping guide took a picture of the table. Oh, I forgot to add his WeChat, I'm so stupid. Chatper 35 Thanks, fourth. Lu Xiaobang looked at him gratefully. It's all brothers, you're welcome. Long Rishan waved his hand and smiled. Um. Soon they were back in the classroom. Da da da. With the sound of footsteps, the head teacher walked in. Dear students, it's May 15th now, and the college entrance examination is less than a month away. In order to have a better review for everyone, we decided to organize an extracurricular exercise and swimming so that everyone can have a better time in this hot summer. Status The head teacher smiled. Wow! Really, that's great! The school is mighty, the old class is mighty. Then I'm going to buy a nice swimsuit. Yes, yes, I want to buy a Mimi swimsuit too. Together. The whole class was happy, and the pressure of the college entrance examination also dissipated a little. Okay, the time is tomorrow and Saturday, the school will not make up classes, everyone will gather on the playground at 8 o'clock tomorrow. At the same time, the school will take into account that the students are going to buy swimsuits, and this afternoon, the get-out-of-class will end at 4.50. You don't have to study at night at night. The head teacher once again said good news. Wow, the school is awesome. The teachers are so nice. The following was lively again. Okay, stop arguing, or I'll let him go into the water in a swimsuit tomorrow. The female head teacher stretched out her hand and pressed it, pretending to be vicious and saying. I know. Laoban, he he. The neat answer below. But fortunately, they all quieted down. Let's start class now. Looking at the classmates in this class, Long Rishan couldn't help but put a smile on his face. This is the classmate who can make friends, and this is the love of classmates. As for learning, after eating the N.I. Linko, his mind became clearer, the problems that were difficult to understand in the past are now easier, and the learning speed has also accelerated. If he were to take the test now, he should be able to score about 650 points. Looking at what the head teacher said, he actually understood it completely, and then he opened the system interface. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Points, 2 Merit Points, 0.51 Repayment, 0 1 million, Term, 1 month and 25 days Low Martial World Ming Dynasty, Debt Point 1, Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf, Debt Point 10, AM and Fenjiun 1, Debt Point 2. Jo World, Not Opened. Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10. Mission, None. Items, Supercomputer Chips. He has already asked about the system of this supercomputer chip 
but it is actually an artificial intelligence chip that does not recognize its owner. That's why he wants to buy a computer. This chip is only useful if it is installed in the computer. The better the computer, the greater the ability of the chip to play. If installed on the mainframe of Tianhe 1, the chip may control the world's network. Get out of class will be over soon. Let's go buy swimming trunks together. Eat by the way. Said Li Longhao. I have something to do with the third child, please buy it for us, boss. Long Rishan said. I'll accompany you. Little Fatty smiled. Okay, then let's go. Uh-huh. Then the two returned to the dormitory. Fourth, what's the matter? Xiao Bang asked curiously. The third child, can you install computer chips? Long Rishan asked. Yes, what's the matter? Then help me put this chip into this new computer. He took out a chip the size of a fingernail and handed it to Xiao Bang. Okay, but it will take two hours. Xiao Bang nodded, took the chip and made it aside. An hour and a half later, Li Longhao and Xiao Pang came back with a bunch of bags. You guys are going for big shopping, buying so many things. Long Rishan said in surprise. Most of it is food. The second one bought it from a foodie. This guy has maxed out my card, so I'm going to eat yours this month, hee <laughs> hee. Li Longhao punched the chubby boy and said angrily. You let me buy it with confidence, so when I saw so many delicious food, I couldn't help it. The fatter said more and more quietly. Okay, I'll take care of this month's food and drink. Chatper 36 I'm going, what swimming trunks did you buy? It's actually leopard print. How can I wear it? Long Rishan shouted while carrying two leopard print swimming trunks. Hey, it's not that the money is not enough, these two items are cheaper, so I bought them. Li Longhao sneered. What about yours? Long Rishan looked at them and said. Cough, here. Li Longhao and Xiao Pang said, taking out one black and one white swimming trunks. I want to change. No. Before he could finish speaking, the two beasts snapped back. You. Long Rishan pointed at them, his left hand covering his chest, with a painful expression on his face. Fourth, your computer is ready, can you take a look at it? Hey. What's the matter with you, fourth? Are you uncomfortable? When Lu Xiaobang turned his head and saw his face full of pain, he couldn't help but say nervously. These are the swimming trunks they bought for you. Long Rishan handed him leopard print swimming trunks with a painful face. Boom. As if struck by lightning, Xiao Bang stared at the leopard print swimming trunks in a daze. Ah. I'm going to kill you. Xiao Bang suddenly shouted, startling the two Xiao Pang beside him. Then there was a loud bang in the dormitory. Half an hour later, Xiao Pang and Li Longhao looked at the leopard print swimming trunks in their hands with tears in their eyes. On the other hand, Xiao Bang was typing codes on his new laptop like nothing else, and there was a pair of black swimming trunks on the table. Long Rishan was holding a pair of white swimming trunks. He was lying on the bed, plugged in the headphones to the computer, and turned on the computer. With a dazzling boot animation, a red panda appeared on the screen. The primary artificial intelligence bear will serve the master, and let the complete data identify the master. A cute voice appeared in his ears. Then he followed the prompts and began to enter various information. Successful recognition of the Lord. Hello master, the little bear will serve you. A little panda said honestly, twisting its butt. Little bear, what abilities do you have now? Long Rishan asked curiously. Master, I can invade all the networks of the Dragon Country, said Little Bear. Can you write games? He glanced at the third child who was typing the code and said involuntarily. Okay Master, I wonder what kind of game the Master wants to write. What advice do you have? Long Rishan threw the question to the cubs. I just surfed the internet, and I think it's best for the Master to write a web game now, because web games don't need a server 
just this computer can work. At the same time, I have optimized the computer again, the performance has increased by 50%, and the memory has been doubled. Okay, then when you make a web game, you must be excellent. Long Rishan said. Yes, master. Then the little bear disappeared from the screen. Hey, I'm only 18 years old in half a year, my grass cake recipe. Long Rishan thought of the smell, so he could not help narrowing his eyes. Hey, fourth, what are you doing? Yin. Little Fatty said while eating the beef jerky. Go. 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 Wait, I can make it myself and try it out, but I don't have to sell it. Seeing what little Fatty was eating, he had a flash of inspiration and patted his thigh. What are you doing, fourth, I'm still eating. A chubby voice came from below. Ha ha ha, it's okay. Thinking of this, he couldn't help laughing happily. Next day. There were more than 300 high school students on the playground, and it was dark. Students, this is an event for the graduating class of senior three. There are a total of 325 people going to the three largest swimming pools in Zhancheng, but you must pay attention to safety. In short, safety first, relaxation second. This time the school didn't say so much, and let them get on the bus after only half an hour. After another half hour drive, they arrived at a swimming pool. Classmates, after changing your swimsuits, you can move freely, but don't go out of the swimming pool. If you need it, you can tell the teacher. Do you understand? Clear. Okay, let's change clothes then. Looking at the crowded students, Long Rishan also stood up and entered the locker room with the three in the dormitory. Chapter 37 At this time, a large swimming pool in the cool swimming pool was reserved by the school, and it was full of students. The white flowers made some nerds who often stayed in the dormitory playing games and reading books for a while, overwhelmed, and a little shy, and they didn't know where to put their eyes. In contrast, girls are more open, because they are naturally playful, and girls are water, so they have a lot of fun. The third and fourth, you go ahead. Li Longhao and Xiao Peng shrank behind Xiao Bang and him, pushing them forward. Wow! Every time they passed a person, they heard a voice that made Li Longhao and Xiao Peng blush. When the four of them walked to the swimming pool, the students in the swimming pool were silent, and their eyes couldn't help looking at them. Wow! this figure. Very handsome. Good skin. This abdominal muscle, this pectoral muscle, how can there be such a perfect person? I feel like I'm in love. You're a man in love and a fart. Long Rishan looked at him with so many glowing eyes, and his heart could not help but tremble. At this moment, a girl in a light blue one-piece swimsuit came over. Hello, can you add QQ? The girl's face was flushed, and her eyes were even more watery, with a bit of charm. Just when he wanted to refuse, a loud voice came. I also want. Add me QQ, handsome guy. Add me. He was surrounded in an instant, and the three people in the dormitory did not know where they were squeezed. Hey, no. Don't touch me. Stop. When a lion's roar came. All the girls stopped and looked in the direction of the voice. I'm going to play with you, stop surrounding Long Rishan, said Long Rishan's head teacher. It turns out that his name is Long Rishan, such a cool name and a handsome man. Yeah, and she's still in such a good shape. I just touched it. You still said, go and play. The head teacher said with a serious look. Is teacher. Long Rishan stared blankly ahead like an abused little daughter-in-law. After seeing the head teacher let them all leave, he looked at the head teacher gratefully, but the lipstick on his face and body made him look a little funny. Are you okay, Rishan? The head teacher walked up to him, grabbed his arm, and looked. But Long Rishan clearly felt that the head teacher's hand was still pinching on his arm. I'm fine, old class. At this point he was about to cry. It's fine. Let's go play. 
The female head teacher squinted and smiled. But the look in his eyes was as terrifying as a demon. Then the head teacher walked away, and the three of Li Longhao came around. Fourth, are you happy? Li Longhao asked with a smirk, how obscene and obscene it was. You look so good. Long Rishan wiped the lipstick on his body and threw his eyes away. Fourth, you don't know how much we envy you, so many girls. Xiao Pang looked at his figure enviously and said. Stop looking at me with that disgusting look. Long Rishan kicked little fatty. Puff. A humanoid wave maker fell into the water, sending a burst of waves. Tisk tisk tisk, I didn't expect your body to be so good, fourth, how did you practice? Li Longhao poked his abdominal muscles and asked. Long Rishan quickly clapped his hand away. It's natural, don't envy it. Cut. Believe it or not. Then go to the pool. As soon as he put half of his foot in, he saw that everyone around him was looking at him with glowing eyes, which made his heart flutter. But still slowly in the water. Fortunately, it didn't look like the beginning, except that some girls would occasionally glance at him. When there was this girl, they surrounded Li Longhao and they wanted to ask for his contact information. It was not until four o'clock that he went home. Back in the dormitory, he lay directly on the bed, not wanting to move at all. The fourth and fourth, you have become a celebrity. Lu Xiaobang exclaimed in surprise. What kind of celebrity do you become? Long Rishan replied weakly. Now the campus network is full of photos of you in the swimming pool, and you have been named the most handsome school grass in our high school. Really? Let me see. Li Longhao and Xiao Peng walked over. Chapter 38 Really, fourth child, you are famous. Golden ratio body, perfect male god. Now this post has reached the university campus network. Li Longhao exclaimed with admiration. It's not good for me to be famous, and it will bring me a lot of trouble. Long Rishan turned over helplessly, looked at them half dead and said. That's right. Many people are now commenting that you and their boyfriends, and some are looking for you to be singled out. That's right, the third child, is there a way to help me delete those posts? Long Rishan said to Xiao Bang. I'll try it. Lu Xiao Bang's fingers began to tap quickly. After a few minutes. No, someone is blocking me from deleting posts. I only deleted a few. I can't do anything about it in college. Lu Xiaobang pushed his glasses and said. Okay, it's fine. Then Long Rishan thought of Little Bear. He sat up, took out his computer, turned it on, and grabbed his headphones. Cub come out. Master, what's your order? A Little Bear walked out. Can you delete the post about me? Long Rishan said. Okay, please wait a moment, Master. The little bear disappeared again. After a minute, he came out. It's been deleted, it's very dangerous, and I was almost discovered. Xiao Xiang said with a look of fear. What's the matter? Long Rishan frowned. I was chased by more than a dozen red guests just now, but luckily I ran away. Be careful next time, don't do it if it's dangerous. Long Rishan said. He didn't expect that there are so many capable people in the country, and even the little bear was almost discovered. On the other side, in a huge sci-fi room, there are multiple computers with young people in their twenties on them. Tiger, how's it going? The other party ran away. What? A dozen of us even let him run away? The other party's technology is so powerful. Try to find him and let him join us. Yes. Long Rishan didn't know that he had been targeted, and he was chatting with Xiao Xiang about web games. Little Bear, is the game already made? Long Rishan asked anxiously. Yes master, it's on the computer desktop now, you can try it out. It is good. He looked at the table, and sure enough, he saw a sign, which was a sword-shaped sign, a sword that fell from the sky with terrifying thunder and lightning wrapped around it. 
Then he clicked in. Without starting the animation, I went directly to the login page. He chose QQ to log in, and then the screen turned again, and 11 characters appeared, 5 men and 5 women, and an androgynous devil. He clicked on the devil first. Roar, cluck. After a terrifying roar came, a female voice also appeared, very charming. Human, do you want to choose me? The devil asked in a male voice first, followed by a female voice. Long Rishan was taken aback by this picture, it felt so realistic, and then he looked at his attributes. Beginning Demon, the Hermaphrodite Demon Clan can produce demon cubs, one demon cub can be born for every two levels. Demon Cub, Attacking, Defense Weak, and Speed. Damn it, the final level is now level 50, isn't it possible to bring 25 Devil Cubs? Little Bear, is there anyone playing perverted? Master, don't worry, look at other heroes first. It is good. Then he clicked on a man with a giant sword and a giant shield. Male giant battle, medium attack, high defense, medium speed. Combination skills, the male and female giants are combined, and the attributes are doubled. Rely on me, I can still fit together. Sure enough, there is a female giant battle. There are also archers, swordsmen, mages, and healers. The mages' combination technique is, the surrounding 10 meters are covered by spells for 2 minutes. Each occupation can be transferred branch. Long Rishan played for a while and found it very interesting, especially the monsters inside, which were very realistic and the picture quality was very good. Xiao Xiang, does this have high requirements on the configuration of the mobile phone? Long Rishan asked. It's not high. And this can be played on the web or downloaded. At the same time, I also made an official website, Master, look. I saw the screen turn to a website full of technology. Master, I'm waiting for your name now, said the little bear. Let's call it Tianjia. Long Rishan thought for a while and came up with a very stinky name. Good Master. With a wave of the little bear's paw, there were two big characters Heavenly Realm on the website. Chapter 39 Little bear, put this game on various websites, but don't put it in an obvious position. He ordered. Yes, master. Little bear walked in again. In this game, he makes money by charging money to buy wedding rings. If you want to use combination skills, you must get married. When using a combo, no matter where the other is, it will be teleported, but the combo can only be used five times a day. After getting all this done, Long Rishan felt relieved. Then he opened the system interface. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Points, 2 Merit Points, 0.51 Repayment, 0-1 million, Term one month 24 days. Low Martial World, Ming Dynasty, Debt Point 1, Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf, Debt Point 10, Aum and Fenjiun 1, Debt Point 2. Jooa World, Not Opened. Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10. Mission, None. Thing. System, Repay. Ding. Repay 1 million, are you sure? Yes. Successful repayment and 2 debt points. He looked at the repayment amount, and sure enough, it reached 10 million, and the repayment date was half a year. There are so many debts, what happened to the system? Long Rishan asked curiously. Every time it reaches 100, it will increase by 1 debt point. The system explained. That means it's going to be 10 billion next time. Yes. Okay. But it could be a little more. System, help me open a world with three debt points. Long Rishan said. Ding, spend three debt points to randomly open the high level low martial world, are you sure? Yes. Open successfully. Super debt collection system. Host, Long Rishan. Debt point. 1. 
Merit points, 0.51. Repayment, 0 slash 10 million, term, half a year. Low Martial World, Ming Dynasty, debt point 1, Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf, debt point 10, AM and Fenjiun 1, debt point 2. Jurassic, accessible. JO World, not opened. Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10. Mission, None. Thing. It's actually Jurassic World, I'll go. The Jurassic is a geological age, bounded between the Triassic and the Cretaceous, from about 199.6 million years ago, with an error of 600,000 years, to 145.5 million years ago with an error of 4 million years. The Jurassic is the second period of the Mesozoic, beginning with the Triassic-Jurassic extinction event. System, you're cheating on me again, I'm going in now to make snacks. Long Rishan said bitterly. According to the ranking of high-level low-level martial arts worlds, Jurassic World's martial arts values are considered very low. The system explained. All right. Although he didn't want this to happen, he couldn't change it. Forget it, sleep. But he didn't know that the game Heavenly World was fermenting on the internet. Hey. I'm not a member. Why is there an advertisement? When Chen Dong was watching TV with his mobile phone, a sign suddenly jumped out. Heavenly World? Is it a game? Out of curiosity, he clicked. I saw a change in the screen and a login interface appeared. Web games. He used QQ to log in, and then ten people fell from the sky, making a loud noise. Boom. Next came Shimo, accompanied by a burst of laughter from men and women. Wow, the picture quality is so good, and the characters are very cool. Chen Dong was surprised. Then he clicked on Shimo, who appeared last. Roar, cluck. I saw Shimo raised his arms high and roared into the sky. Human, do you want to choose me? A hoarse male voice and a charming female voice came slowly, and Shimo's eyes seemed to be looking at him through the screen. It's so real. Chen Dong said excitedly. The following is the introduction. Beginning demon, the hermaphrodite demon clan can produce demon cubs, one demon cub can be born for every two levels. Demon cub. Attacking, defense weak, and speed. Just an introduction. Chen Dong wondered. But he still chose Shimo, just because of the sentence human, do you want to be me first, this sentence really shocked him. As he chose to enter the game, the ground beneath Shimo burst suddenly, Shimo quickly fell down and smashed to the ground. Boom. This scene startled him, and then he played excitedly again. Chatper 40. Beyond the nickname, I found a very interesting game. Not only Chen Dong played it, but hundreds of people in Longwo played it. Everyone has their own small circle, and some people also share this on other platforms. And there are people who made a post on Weibo saying that although most people don't believe it, there are still a small number of people who believe it. In this way, more and more people fell into the pit. The next day was Sunday, and there was no class. Long Rishan got up early in the morning, went for a run on the playground, then had breakfast, and brought breakfast to the three animals. It smells so good. He had just entered the dormitory, and the chubby who was lying on the bed without even opening his eyes sniffed and muttered. It's amazing, as expected of a foodie. Long Rishan gave him a like. Get up, it's on fire. He took a deep breath and then roared. It's on fire. Li Longhao murmured and turned over. What, is it on fire? Then he suddenly opened his eyes and got up quickly. Where is the fire, where is the fire? All three got up and asked while putting on their shoes. Suddenly Si Long Rishan looking at them with a smile on his face. Okay, fourth, how dare you lie to brothers, brothers, beat him. Li Longhao shouted. Hey, I thought you would be happy if you get up early to buy breakfast for you, but I didn't expect you to beat me. 
Long Rishan put on an aggrieved expression and covered his face with his hands. What, there is breakfast, where is it? Xiao Pang asked immediately when he heard the breakfast. Here. Ha ha ha, I didn't expect it to be a misunderstanding. I said, how could someone as good as the fourth child lie to us? It turned out to be trying to wake us up. Exactly. The other two clapped. Uh, you guys are amazing. He said in admiration. Then they ate breakfast while Long Rishan went back to bed. Turning on the computer, I saw Little Bear walking out slowly. Little Bear, how is the heaven? Five hundred people logged in last night, and there are still more people logging in now. How's their reaction? I think we can add exclusive mounts. Little Bear suggested. Okay, you decide this. Long Rishan said. By the way, Little Bear, I want to open a shop, but I'm not old enough. What can you do? The best way is to buy a store and buy it together with the business license. You can also let your relatives do it. Said the bear. Well, I didn't say it. Long Rishan didn't understand this, so he was afraid of being deceived. By the way, are you guys going out to play? Rest today. Li Longhao said. Where to play? Little Fatty asked. My daughter-in-law said to go shopping, her best friend will be with her. Then let's go, it's boring in the dormitory anyway. But at this moment, Long Rishan's cell phone rang, showing Zioki. Hey, Zioki, what's the matter? He asked gently. Woohoo, brother, dad was beaten and is now in the hospital. There was a burst of crying, and then Zioki said. What, don't worry. I'll go back right now. Long Rishan hung up the phone and put on his shoes. Boss, I have something to do at home, so I won't accompany you. You guys have fun. Okay, pay attention to safety and call if you have anything. He then rushed out of the school with his notebook and stopped a taxi. Master, go to the hospital in Wangxiang town. Okay, sit down. Although it's a bit far. The important thing is that there is more money, and the driver didn't say anything. It's faster than taking a bus, and it takes an hour to arrive. Hey, Zioki, brother is here, where are you? All right. Then Long Rishan gave 500 yuan to the driver and ran up to the second floor. By asking the nurse, I found the ward where my uncle was. Boom. Uncle, how are you? Seeing lying on the bed, his right foot was in a plaster cast. He asked breathlessly. Xiao Tian, why are you here? Uncle is fine. Uncle saw him with a smile on his face. The legs are broken and they say it's fine. The aunt next to her said with red and swollen eyes. Auntie, what's going on? Long Rishan asked in a cold voice with cold light in his eyes. Chapter 41 Today your uncle went fishing and caught a white-flowered fish. When a thug saw it, he wanted to spend 200 yuan to buy it. Of course, your uncle refused to sell it. Later, the thug called a few people to beat your uncle. They also stole the white fish. The white fish, also known as the yellow lip fish, 20,000 pounds. My aunt was crying. Long Rishan clenched his hands into fists his fingernails digging into his flesh. Uncle, do you know which village they are from? He asked coldly. They should be from Luwe village, Xiao Tian, don't go to them, uncle is fine. Uncle said nervously. Don't worry, uncle, I won't go to them. A smile appeared on Long Rishan's face, but killing intent flashed in his eyes. They are his only relatives. If something happens, let him do it, so relatives are his inverse scales. Then he took care of his uncle in the hospital for a while, then made an excuse to leave, and went to Luwe village by motorcycle. When no one saw him, he put on his armor and walked towards the village. Because there is no surveillance or anything in the village, I don't worry about being known to be him. Ouch! It's not stupid that someone is wearing this to run around, isn't it? 
An arrogant voice came, and someone knocked on his armor. It's possible that the past two days have been a bit silly. That person gave us a fish worth tens of thousands of dollars this morning. Another voice laughed arrogantly. Long Rishan's eyes froze, then turned to look at them. Five middle-aged people, wearing ordinary clothes, flip-flops on their feet, and cigarettes in their mouths, the other end is even more up to the sky. There were also people around him pointing and pointing. You are courting death. He shouted in a hoarse voice and slammed a heavy fist into one of them. Bang! The man flew out, blood on the corner of his mouth, and howled on the ground. But he didn't stop, and kicked another one. Mom, dare to beat people in our village, everyone. The other three rushed up, and then the onlookers rushed to Long Rishan with bricks and wooden sticks. Long Rishan didn't care about the others, so he saw the five middle-aged people fight. Five minutes later, the five middle-aged men fell to the ground and wailed, while the others did not dare to move forward, looking at him with terrified targets. Long Rishan gave them a cold look, and then stepped on the joints of the five middle-aged people's feet. Crack! Ah, my feet, my feet! The middle-aged man hugged his feet and was in pain. As if he didn't hear his cry, Long Rishan stepped on his other foot. Crack! The crisp bone sound resounded in the ears of everyone, causing them to quickly retreat. After the other four middle-aged people looked at it, they wanted to get up and run away, but how could Long Rishan let them escape? A kick kicked back again, and then there was a sound of bone shattering. One by one fainted in pain. Take the way of people, and treat people's bodies. Long Rishan said coldly, and disappeared in the village. Hurry up and save people, hurry up and call the police. Some farmers shouted hastily. On the other hand, Long Rishan removed his armor and went back to the town with a slap in the face. Back in town, he asked Xiao Xiang to delete all his monitoring, and then went back to the hospital to pay his uncle's expenses, as well as a few more days of hospitalization. Then I went to the mall again, bought a bunch of supplements and food, and then went back to the hospital. Little Tim, why waste money buying a bunch of useless things? Your aunt made chicken soup. When my uncle saw a bunch of supplements, he couldn't help but get angry. These things are worthless. Uncle's body is important. He said with a smile. Oh, it's your uncle who has troubled you. Don't say that, uncle, I believe good people are rewarded. Hopefully. By the way, uncle, I've transferred to Zhancheng High School to study now. I'm going back now. You need to eat more supplements. I'll go first. Long Rishan said. Okay, go, pay attention to safety. Uncle nodded. Little Chi, come out. He said to Xiaoqi and walked out. What's the matter, brother Xiao Tian? Xiao Qi asked curiously. Here is 100,000 yuan. While my uncle is recovering from the injury, you should buy more delicious food. Don't let your uncle and aunt go out to work. We will talk about it when the injury is healed. You can buy whatever you want. You don't have to ask your uncle to get the money, but you can't spend it. If you let me know that you spend it, I won't take care of you. Long Rishan urged. I know brother. Although she wondered where the money came from, it was better not to ask at this time. Chapter 42 it was four o'clock in the afternoon and he was going back to school, then he took a taxi and spent another five hundred bucks to get back to school. This made him feel particularly inconvenient without a car. I am back. As soon as he entered the dormitory, he said. But when I saw the empty dormitory, I looked at the time and found that it was only half past five. These three guys haven't come back yet, they are too good to go shopping. He murmured. Sighing, lying on the bed, turned on the computer. Little bear, how is heavenly world? Master, there are currently 5,000 people logged in, and the maximum number of people logged in is 7,000. Little bear said. What about income? 
This question is what he most wants to know. The income from last night to now is 5,000 yuan. Little Bear said. So much. Long Rishan said in surprise. There are not many masters, the minimum for an exclusive mount is 10 yuan, and the maximum is 100. Little Bear explained. Oh, good. Today Buddy is so happy, so happy. At this time, the voices of Xiao Peng and the others appeared outside the door, followed by the sound of the door opening. Crack. You're back, why are you so happy? Are you picking up money? He asked suspiciously. I didn't pick up money, but I picked up a few QQ numbers. Li Longhao said with a smile. What do you mean? Long Rishan was a little confused. We got my sister-in-law's best friend's QQ number, ha ha ha. Little Fatty said with a big laugh. Uh, this can be so happy. Long Rishan was a little speechless. You're a full man who doesn't know the muscles of a hungry man. Xiao Pang rolled his eyes at him. Okay, have you eaten yet? Eat, haven't you eaten? No. And just like that, it's June. Students, the results of the mock test this time are out. The first place in our class in Chinese is Long Rishan, with a score of 148. The head teacher laughed. Wow. There were bursts of surprise and applause. Long Rishan walked over lightly, took the paper, nodded and walked back. Soon, all the papers were issued, and he scored a total of 684 points for several subjects, a very high score. He is less eager for college now, and can get into every school with his grades. While facing the college entrance examination, a hot game heaven appeared in the game industry. Many people are playing Heavenly World now, and the number of people online has reached 500,000, which has also brought Long Rishan's income to tens of millions. This is only half a month. Just yesterday, he asked Xiao Xiang to register a leather bag company overseas, and then subordinated the heaven to it. At the same time, he also spent nearly 10 million to order several sets of servers. Also rented an office building. Fourth, have you decided which school to go to? Li Longhao came over and asked. I don't know yet. Let's see. How about you? My wife and I decided to apply to Jinghua University. The second and third should apply to Ocean University. Li Longhao said. Oh, let me think about it. It is good. He wants to do business in the future, and the company will open here, because he wants to develop the economy here, so he can't go that far to study. In Zhancheng, there are two universities, one is Ocean and the other is Normal. He can't choose Normal. There is only ocean. June 7th. Today is the time for the college entrance examination. It can be said that there are a lot of people, but most of them are family members. As the exam bell rang, the whole school was silent for a while, except for the sound outside the school gate. Most of the parents stood under the scorching sun with umbrellas, sweating profusely. Soon it was afternoon, and as the bell rang, some students came out gradually, some with happy expressions and some with sighs. Chapter 43 Finally the exam is over. It has been half a month, and he has spent half a month in reviewing, and he has no time to enter the world, which makes him a little boring. Fourth, we are about to separate soon. There will be a dinner party in the class, come together. Li Longhao said softly. Okay. To be honest, although he has only been here for less than a month, he can really feel their goodness. The same is true of the classmates in the class. Although they will envy him, they will never be jealous. Especially girls, who are so good to him that they don't even know how many love letters they have received. Okay, that's it. At 7 o'clock tonight, at the Camo Hotel. Li Longhao said happily. Have you settled on a location? Long Rishan asked. I haven't called yet. Then let me decide, it's a gift to my classmates. Okay, you are a local tyrant, you have the final say, ha ha ha. The Camo Hotel is a three-star hotel, 
but the consumption in it is very high. The minimum cost of a meal is 1,000 yuan. He is afraid that his classmates cannot afford it. Most of the classmates are from rural families. And he hasn't invited the whole class to dinner yet. Then he found Camo's reservation number and called. Hello, this is the Camo Hotel, what can I do for you? A sweet voice came. Hello, I want to make a reservation. Okay, how many seats do you need? About 40 or 50 people, 7 o'clock tonight. My surname is Long. Okay, Mr. Long, we will reserve an oversized box for you, which can seat 70 people. Do you need anything else? There is none left. If not, sir, you can follow our camo official account, where you can order food, and you need to pay a deposit in advance. It is good. If Mr. Nalong is all right, then I will hang up first. I wish you a happy life. After hanging up the phone, he followed Camo's official account, ordered a dish of 50,000 yuan, and paid a deposit. After doing all this, he breathed a sigh of relief. To be honest, he had never done any of these things, like inviting people to dinner, calling to order food, and he could only blame him for not having trusted friends around him at that time. Soon it was night, and under the leadership of the head teacher, the whole class set off to the Como Hotel together. When stepping into the Como Hotel, many students were amazed. But this does not include Long Rishan, who has entered the Royal Casino, and a three-star hotel is nothing. Then he went to the front desk. Hello, I made a reservation not long ago, my surname is Long. Then open the order page again. Hello Mr. Long, your box is ready, please come with me. The beautiful front desk walked in front of her with small steps. Let's go old class. Then they came to a huge box with two large tables, and forty people sat down and asked. Classmates, sit down and drink some water first, and the dishes will be served soon. Long Rishan smiled at everyone. Classmates, today is the last day for us to get together. I don't know when the next time will be. During this period of time, everyone's care and concern for me will be remembered in my heart. If you have any difficulties in the future, you can find them. I can help. He said loudly to the classmates who had already sat down. Just help if you can really help. One of the girls stood up with a smile. Certainly. He felt a little bad, but the words had already been said, so he could only bite the bullet. I'm missing a boyfriend now, why don't you be my boyfriend? The girl said seriously. Wow. Song Nian, good work. This. Long Rishan's scalp is numb now, the joke is getting bigger. Although the girl in front of him is not bad, he still doesn't want to fall in love. I don't want to fall in love yet. I'm sorry. He had no choice but to bite the bullet and say. No way. You didn't say that you're not my boyfriend, which means I still have a chance. When you want to fall in love, if I show up again, I'll keep waiting. Song Nian shook his small fist. The head teacher and other teachers watched this scene and didn't say anything, after all, they had already graduated. Chapter 44 It can be said that this meal is very embarrassing. Of course, this is only embarrassing for Long Rishan himself and others are not so embarrassed. Especially the eyes of some girls, as if he did something wrong to her. After eating, they went to KTV to sing. Song Club Long Rishan went to open a big room and ordered a lot of drinks and snacks. Alright Yen, is it really you? Suddenly, a sweet voice stopped him. Mu Shuaying, why is she here? He wondered in his heart. Well let's play with my classmates. After all, they knew each other before, so he nodded anyway. Me too, why don't you get to know him? Mu Shuaying looked at him with hope. No, you guys have fun. Long Rishan shook his head and said lightly. Shuaying, why don't you go in? A young man dressed like a dog walked in. I'm fine, I just met a friend. 
Mu Shuang said immediately with a cold face. Ha, where is my friend? Lu Yang looked at Long Rishan, who was a little more handsome than himself, and couldn't help but want to show off his muscles. I'm a student. Long Rishan glanced at him lightly and said slowly. Student, it's very good. If you can't find a job after graduation, come to me and I'll give you a job. Lu Yang thought to himself, how could a little student compete with me? No need. Long Rishan shook his head lightly. Shuang, your friend is very disrespectful, do you feel wrong to work in my company? Lu Yang pretended to be angry. I go first. Long Rishan couldn't get used to this kind of fool who treats others as fools, so he turned around and walked in the direction of the teacher. Hey, Rishan. Mu Shuang quickly followed. Poor boy, how dare you steal a woman from Lao Tzu, I really don't know whether to live or die. Lu Yang's face immediately turned gloomy, he took out his mobile phone and made a call. Mu Shuang was called by her best friend. When she saw her for the first time, she was attracted by her appearance and figure, but now suddenly there was a roadblock, which made him not angry. Fourth, why did you go to open a room and bring a beautiful woman back, can't it be? Li Longhao smiled at him vulgarly. Don't talk nonsense, she insists on coming. Long Rishan said with a wry smile. When Mu Shuang heard his words, she was so angry that she wanted to knock him to death. Why do you want me to insist on following me? What an idiot. Hello everyone, my name is Mu Shuang, I'm Rishan's girlfriend. Mu Shuang said to everyone with a smile. What? Does he have a girlfriend? Didn't he say not to fall in love? What should Song Nian do? This woman is definitely prettier than Song Nian. The other students were talking, and Song Nian looked even more sad. Mu Shuang, don't talk nonsense. Long Rishan turned around and said with a stern face. Seeing his angry look, she was proud for a while, so she stepped forward and brought Cherry's mouth close to his ear. If you promise to go shopping with me, I won't make trouble. A gust of fragrant wind blew into his ears, making him a little itchy. No. Long Rishan whispered through gritted teeth. No, I'll continue to say, let everyone think I'm your girlfriend, see how you can pick up girls. Mu Shuang said proudly, making you indifferent to me. You, well, just once. It is good. Their conversation was quick, just seconds. Actually, I was joking with everyone. I was a classmate from Rishan's former school. I saw him today, so I made a joke with him. Don't you have his girlfriend? Cluck cluck. Mu Shuang explained. I'll just say, Long Rishan is not that kind of person. That's right, I've never seen him interacting with girls. Now Song Nian should be relieved. Sure enough, when Song Nian heard this, his mood suddenly improved a lot, and even Mu Shuang became pleasing to the eye. Okay, let's go in. Then the group entered the room. Chapter 45 Mu Shuang sat on Long Rishan's left, Song Nian sat on his right, and the two brought him something to eat from time to time. At this moment, there was a loud noise from outside the room. What happened? Long Rishan and the teachers stood up and walked out. Mu Shuang and the others followed. When he opened the door, he saw several waiters surrounding a boy. The boy was his classmate, Li Shuo, and there was a broken bottle of red wine on the ground. What happened? Long Rishan walked over and asked coldly. Are you his friend? He broke a bottle of red wine and lost money. A 1.8 meter waiter said condescendingly. Rishan, I didn't, he hit me. Li Shuo said in a panic. Did you hear that, my classmate said that you hit him and stained his clothes. How does that count? Long Rishan said coldly. I have witnesses. These waiters have seen it. What? Do you want to default? The waiter said arrogantly. What's the matter? Why are they all around here? At this moment, a serious voice came, and a fat man with a belly came in. 
Manager, he broke the wine, and he's cheating. The waiter shouted. Is that so? This wine is 100,000 yuan, lose money, or we will call the police. Lu Ming said loudly. Let's watch the video and talk. Long Rishan's eyes became colder and colder. I'm sorry, this monitor is broken today, and I haven't had time to repair it. Lu Ming said with a slightly raised corner of his mouth. Yes. I saw Long Rishan took out his mobile phone and a video was played in front of everyone. In the video, I saw a waiter holding a drink, deliberately bumped past Li Shuo, and knocked Li Shuo down. You, why do you have this video? The fat manager Lu Ming panicked for a while, and then he regained his composure. Since it's our waiter's fault, then forget it, it's all a misunderstanding. Lu Ming said with a haha. How about my classmates' clothes? Long Rishan said coldly. This has to be compensated, you, do you mind paying this guest a bottle of wine? Lu Ming said to the waiter seriously. No problem manager. The waiter nodded. Okay, all guests can go in first, and the wine will be delivered soon. Lu Ming smiled. Seeing this, Long Rishan gave him a cold look and walked back to the room. Five minutes later, the door opened and a waiter came in with a bottle of beer. Boom! Looking at the bottle of beer, Long Rishan's eyes froze, and he slammed his hands on the table. Forget it, the fourth one. Li Longhao quickly grabbed him. They will regret it. Long Rishan's eyes flashed with cold light, his hands were clenched, and his blue veins burst out. Uh huh. Soon, the party ended in unhappiness which made Long Rishan fill with anger and could not calm down. After telling them something and letting them go first, Long Rishan put on his armor in a hidden place. Then walked into the Kinga club. Stop, what are you doing? Two security guards stopped him. Boom bang! Two punches smashed them out. Then go inside. At this time, more and more security guards rushed out, took out batons and smashed at him. But this kind of attack did no harm to him at all. With the sound of pain, Long Rishan walked to the bar, smashed all the wine he could see, and kicked the waiter just now. This foot is enough for him to lie down for half a month. Too bad I didn't see the manager. Having done all this, he left, or else he would have to go for tea. Seeing his dormitory being empty, he was very reluctant to part with him this time and it would take more than a month to get together again. Chatper 46 Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Point, 1 Merit Points, 0.51 Repayment, 0 slash 10 million, term, half a year Low Martial World, Ming Dynasty, Debt Point 1, Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf, Debt Point 10 AM and Fenjiun 1, Debt Point 2. Jurassic, Accessible. JOA World, Not Opened. Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10. Mission, None. Thing. It's time to enter Jurassic World. With the two newly bought knives, and some food, put these into the inventory. System. I'm going to enter the Jurassic. Start teleporting. Successful delivery. In a flash of white light, he disappeared into the room. The Jurassic period is a world of dinosaurs. The overlords of the dinosaurs are, Brontosaurus, Sanguisaurus, Stegosaurus, Ankylosaurus, Tyrannosaurus rex, and Duckguansaurus. Among them, only Tyrannosaurus rex is a carnivorous dinosaur. Tyrannosaurus rex has a body as high as 14 meters and weighs about 10 metric tons. Its hind legs are so thick and strong that it can even support a rhino each. In a grassland, a few Ankylosaurus are leisurely eating grass, and there are small Ankylosaurus playing next to them. At this time, a white light flashed, and a figure appeared in the middle of the dragon. Roar! This figure startled Jia Long, and they all shouted at him but did not launch an attack. Long Rishan had just appeared, and when he saw his dinosaur in front of him, 
he couldn't help but be startled, he quickly pulled out his steel knife and defended nervously. The system, you cheated me again, and let me fall into the dinosaur nest. Looking at these dinosaurs, which were ten meters long, two meters wide and one meter high, he broke out in a cold sweat. The host can rest assured that this is a herbivorous dinosaur, Ankylosaurus, with a mild temperament and will not attack creatures that pose no threat to them, the system explained. Okay. Hearing the system's explanation, he slowly put down the knife, but he was still nervous as he looked at these ankylosing dragons. Ding! The task is to be released, please check it yourself. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan Debt Point, 1 Merit Points, 0.51 Repayment, 0 slash 10 million, Term, Half a Year Low Martial World, Ming Dynasty, Debt Point 1, Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf, Debt Point 10, Aum and Fenjiun 1, Debt Point 2 Jurassic, Debt Point 3 J.O. World, Not Opened Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10 The Task of Debt Collection Task, Tyrannosaurus Rex is the Overlord of the Jurassic Period Recover a Tyrannosaurus Rex egg. Rewards, 3 Debt Points Tyrannosaurus Rex Gene Serum. Side Quest, Collect 20 different kinds of dinosaur eggs, the more the number, the better the reward. Thing. System. This is a Tyrannosaurus Rex, not a Tyrannosaurus bug. I'll turn into dung when bitten by it. Long Rishan complained. At this time, he felt his feet being hugged by something, which startled him a lot. When he looked down, he saw a small ankylosaurus crawling up his pants. So cute! His eyes lit up in an instant, and he bent down to pick up Xiao Jialong. Roar! Before the hands could touch, there was a roar from the side. Uh! Brother ankylosing dragon, I just want to hug, nothing else. Long Rishan looked at the ankylosing dragon with a smile, and stepped back nervously. Although Ankylosaurus is a herbivorous dinosaur, even Tyrannosaurus rex dare not provoke it. It is no joke to be hammered by the hammer behind it. The ankylosing dragon approached him slowly, then lowered his head and picked up the little ankylosing dragon. Then he ignored him and left. Hey, don't be so arrogant, okay, let's be friends. Long Rishan shouted. But the only thing in exchange was the wagging tail. Cut, just ignore it. Long Rishan shook his head and walked smartly into the forest. Walking into the forest, he immediately became vigilant. This is a world dominated by dinosaurs, the overlords of the earth. If he didn't wear armor, he could not even beat two raptors. Then he put on the armor and walked cautiously. Roar. At this moment, a cry rang out. Then a 2-meter-long, 0.5-meter-high dinosaur rushed towards him. Is this a raptor? Damn, what are you really saying? After a while, a dozen raptors surrounded him. Long Rishan held a steel knife and frowned and stared around. Roar! With a roar, the raptor quickly pounced on him. Chapter 47 Puff he slashed a raptor with force, and the blood stained his armor. But several raptors also came to him. Buzz. Several harsh metallic sounds rang out, and firelight rubbed out. Boom. The raptors flew to one side, shook their heads, and rushed over again. Pfft. The knife in his hand slid across the bodies of the two raptors again, and blood spurted out. But he was hit by a few raptors again sending him flying forward. He is very helpless now, if there is more, he may be dragged to death. What? Long Rishan roared, and quickly cut the two raptors into two sections, then quickly turned around, blocked the raptors behind, and pulled the knife fiercely. Pfft! The entire head was cut off. Roar! At this time, the raptor was afraid, and instead of attacking again, it slowly retreated. It is said that the Velociraptor is the smartest dinosaur, 
and as expected, knowing that Long Rishan could not be hurt, he quickly retreated, leaving six corpses behind. Ding! The host can recycle dinosaur corpses, giving the host one kilogram for every ten kilograms. The system said at this time. What's the use of dinosaur meat? Long Rishan asked. Dinosaur meat has a lot of energy. Eating it can enhance physique and strength, and there is a certain chance to change genes and become superhuman. The system explained. Does it work for me too? Some. His current physical strength is still too poor. If the Velociraptor hadn't retreated just now, it would definitely be him who lay down after half an hour. Then he recovered six raptors and got 18 pounds of raptor meat. Roar. At this moment, a huge roar came, which made the leaves tremble. T-Rex. Long Rishan's eyes narrowed and he quickly ran in the opposite direction of the voice. Five minutes into his walk, a giant foot appeared. Boom! A dinosaur with a body length of about 11.5 to 14.7 meters, a height of nearly 6 meters, and a head length of about 1.5 meters appeared, with footprints behind it. Roar! A voice that shook the space came from the huge mouth. As if to announce that it is the overlord of the world. At this time, Long Rishan walked into a cave. There was a stench in the silent cave and he knew it was a dinosaur den. He has a mission to collect 20 kinds of dinosaur eggs, so he can only come in and spy on the situation. After walking for two minutes, he came to a huge space. I saw a lot of bones piled up on the ground, and some of them had some shredded meat attached to them. And there are three white things next to it. This is, a dinosaur egg. Long Rishan was pleasantly surprised. He didn't expect him to be so lucky, and he actually met him. In order to prevent the dinosaurs from coming back, he quickly collected the three eggs and ran out of the cave. Ding, recover three Allosaurus eggs. It turned out to be the egg of Allosaurus, a bipedal, predatory dinosaur with a body length of 8 to 10 meters and a weight of 1.5 to 3.3 tons. It has a large skull with large holes to reduce weight and has angular crowns above the eyes. The skull consists of several separate bones with movable joints between the bones, and the jaw can be opened up and down first when eating, and then spread it left and right to swallow food, the lower jaw can slide back and forth, the mouth has dozens of large, sharp, curved teeth, the forelimbs are small, the hands have three fingers, the claws are large and curved, and the length is 25 centimeters, the tail is long and heavy, can balance the body and head. A few hundred meters away from the cave, there was a terrifying cry in the direction of the cave. Roar! It's good to go quickly, or it will become dung. Long Rishan breathed a sigh of relief. Mummy, it's getting dark now, you have to find a place to live. Looking at the sky, he found that it was slowly getting dark, and he was a little crazy. Which world doesn't have a house to live in? It's good to have a cave when you get here. I really don't know how those people who traveled to the Jurassic lived. After walking for half an hour, it was completely dark, and he was still wandering in the forest, not even seeing a cave. Chapter 48 He had no choice but to find a big tree and climbed up. Then he took out a loaf of bread and ate it. This should be the first loaf of bread in the dinosaur world. Eating bread more than 100 million years ago is really, invincible in the world. I just want to ask who else?" Long Rishan said narcissistically. Squeak! A rat-like voice sounded, making him vigilant. Looking down the tree, I saw a small dinosaur walking carefully again, holding a big ball in its claws. This is... Egg-stealing dragon. Overaptorosaurus, is a small theropod dinosaur, 1.8 to 2.5 meters in length. It is about 2 meters long, the size of an ostrich, with sharp claws and a long tail. It is speculated that it has strong athletic ability and agility. It can use a tough tail like a kangaroo to maintain balance and run fast. Ha ha ha, thief dragon, is this egg for me? Long Rishan laughed. Then he took out the crossbow. Fortunately, he brought a crossbow, 
otherwise he might not be able to catch the egg-stealing dragon, knowing that the egg-stealing dragon is best at stealing eggs and escaping. The Dark Knight did not block his vision, he raised the crossbow in both hands, then aimed and pressed the trigger. Call out! The crossbow bolts shot at the egg-stealing dragon like light. Squeak! The egg-stealing dragon suddenly turned around when he heard the sound. Puff! The crossbow arrow shot directly from the corner of its mouth, brought out a few drops of blood, and then fell to the ground. Long Rishan jumped up from the tree and walked over carefully with a knife. Seeing that the Overaptor wasn't moving, he picked up a dinosaur egg. Ding, recover one subcutter dragon egg. Herbivorous dinosaurs, alas, why aren't they the eggs of Tyrannosaurus rex? Long Rishan said a little dissatisfied. Then the corpse of the egg-stealing dragon was collected again. The next day. He woke up from the tree, washed his face with mineral water, and rinsed his mouth casually before throwing the bottle away, which could be regarded as something for later humans to study. A new day has begun, go find eggs, and stop by the Tyrannosaurus rex to find out about the situation. He raised his hands high and shouted passionately. In this Jurassic world, there are tall trees everywhere, and a person appears very small in the woods. Ow! A huge roar came, and then the ground began to shake. Earthquake Dragon He was a little excited to say that the largest creature on land in the dinosaur world was Seismosaurus, the longest reaching 50 meters, shaking the ground with every step. He ran to the sound, and after a few minutes, he saw a large pillar that was shaking to the sky, and he knew that it was the earthquake dragon eating. Ho ho ho! At this time, a continuous scream sounded. I saw dozens of raptors rushing towards the earthquake dragon quickly. Boom! At this time, earthquake dragon had discovered the danger and planned to leave, but how could the slow earthquake dragon escape the hunting of the velociraptor? I saw the raptor's sharp claw slammed into the flesh, no matter how the earthquake dragon swung it, it couldn't get it off, and it could only bleed. From a distance, it is a dense pile. A few minutes later, the earthquake dragon quickly collapsed. Boom! The velociraptor was crushed to death in an instant, but the earthquake dragon also died. Seeing this scene, Long Rishan swallowed and quickly left the battlefield. A month later, he crouched nervously in a camouflaged bush, with a few drops of cold sweat on his forehead. And what he was staring at was a 15-meter-long Tyrannosaurus rex. And behind the Tyrannosaurus rex, is a huge cave. In the past month, he completed the side quest and collected more than 50 eggs, thanks to the egg-stealing dragon. Today he has to complete the task of Tyrannosaurus rex. He has been squatting here for a day and he has not seen the Tyrannosaurus rex go out to hunt. He is waiting for an opportunity. Roar! I saw a roar of the Tyrannosaurus rex, and the huge sound stimulated his eardrums. He thought that when the Tyrannosaurus rex found him, suddenly the Tyrannosaurus turned its head and ran away. Finally gone, my legs are numb. Long Rishan stood up, moved his legs, and then quickly rushed into the cave like a tall building. The stench inside was extremely fishy, and an unpleasant smell rushed into his nose, making him want to vomit. He glanced at the cave quickly and found a huge egg in the innermost part of the cave. Finally found you. Long Rishan was excited and ran to the dragon egg. Just then, a strong voice came from outside. No, the Tyrannosaurus Rex is back. He quickly put away the dinosaur eggs, and with a sound in his mind, he shouted, return. When he just disappeared, a bloody mouth bit his place. Roar! Seeing the enemy disappear, the Tyrannosaurus Rex went mad, roaring and rushing out of the cave. Chapter 49 Long Rishan appeared in his room, with long hair and some mustache, still dirty and sweaty on his face. Hey, hey! He sat on the ground, breathing heavily. After a while, he got up to take a shower. Half an hour later, Long Rishan lay on the bed and looked at the system interface. Super Debt Collection System Host, Long Rishan
Debt points, 4. Merit points, 0.51. Repayment, 0 slash 10 million, term, half a year. Low Martial World, Ming Dynasty, Debt point 1, Pleasant Goat and Big Big Wolf, Debt point 10, Aum and Fenjiun 1, Debt point 2. Jurassic, Debt point 3. Jioa World, Not Opened. Mythical World, The Return of the Great Sage of Journey to the West, Merit Points, 10. Mission, None. Items, Tyrannosaurus Rex Gene Serum, 95 caddies of dinosaur meat, dragon crocodile eggs. System, What will happen if I inject Tyrannosaurus Rex Gene Serum? Long Rishan asked. The gene serum produced by the system does not have any side effects. It will give you the power of a Tyrannosaurus Rex, and at the same time you can consume a lot of physical energy to transform into a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Is the Tyrannosaurus Rex I transformed into the same size as the one in Jurassic? No, this depends on the amount of physical fitness. The system explained. Okay. What's the matter with this dragon crocodile egg? Long Rishan took out a 20 centimeter egg and asked in confusion. This is the host's reward for completing the side quest. The dragon crocodile is bigger than the prehistoric giant crocodile. The whole body can reach 50 meters. The Tyrannosaurus Rex can only be a side dish in front of it. The host can identify the master with a drop of blood. Said the system. So awesome. Long Rishan exclaimed in surprise. Then he bit his finger and pressed the blood on the egg. The wound on his finger slowly healed, and it was the blood of undead that worked. I saw a flash of light from the dragon egg, and the blood disappeared instantly. Crack. The dragon crocodile egg cracked instantly, and a small dragon crocodile climbed out, then climbed in his direction and climbed onto his hand. Long Rishan could feel a touch of kindness from the little dragon crocodile. From now on, you are my little baby, so let's call you Xiao Long. He touched the still soft skin and smiled happily. What? When Xiao Long heard these words, his seven centimeter long mouth opened, as if he wanted to call him. Come on, Dad will cook for you. Long Rishan instantly became a father, but the child was a little crocodile. Then he put the little dragon on his shoulder, went into the kitchen, took out the dinosaur meat and made it. After half an hour. Xiao Long, eat. Long Rishan put Xiao Long on the dining table next to him, with a plate of fragrant meat in front of him. When Xiao Long saw it, his small mouth suddenly opened and bit towards the plate. Xiao Long, that can't be eaten. It's just that it's too late. Crack. The plate was bitten to pieces in an instant, and then Xiao Long ate the plate and the meat into his stomach. Xiao Long, Aren't you afraid of diarrhea? Long Rishan looked at Xiao Long in surprise and murmured. Oh, no, Xiao Long, come and try to bite Dad. He put his fingers in front of it. Although Xiao Long didn't understand why he did this, he was still very obedient. Crack. A sound of broken bones sounded. Ah. Xiao Long stop 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 Long Rishan hurriedly shouted when Xiao Long opened his mouth, his finger was already bloody, but it could be seen that it was healing very fast. Xiao Long, you are so powerful when you were born. If you grow to a complete body, wouldn't you be able to bite off an aircraft carrier in one bite? Long Rishan was amazed, the more he looked at Xiao Long, the more he liked it. At this moment, his phone rang. Owner. I saw Bear appeared on his phone. What's wrong, little bear? Long Rishan asked curiously, little bear should not look for him if he's okay. Master, the whale sky group wants to acquire the heaven realm, said little bear. I will reject any acquisitions in the future. 
By the way, how about the online game Heavenly World? Long Rishan asked. Now I have hired a few employees, and now the online game has 1 million online users. Okay, then you can develop more games, and you can use the money as you like. You don't need to tell me these things, it's all under your control. Long Rishan really didn't want to care about this, as long as he had the money to spend it on. Yes, Master. Then Bear hung up the phone. Chatper 50. Ding ding ding. The phone just hung up rang again. Hey, little bear, is there anything else? Brother, what a bear, I'm Zyoki. Zyoki's voice came from the opposite side. Ah, Zyoki. What's the matter with Zyoki? Long Rishan asked a little embarrassedly. Dad was discharged from the hospital yesterday and asked you to come over for dinner. Zyoki said. Okay, I know, let's go tonight. Uh-huh. Then he hung up. Then he ate dinosaur meat. This meat is no different from beef, and the taste is a little better than beef. After eating, I felt warm all over my body, and I also felt that my strength increased a little. At this time, he saw the little dragon beside him, and he seemed to feel that it suddenly became a little bigger and darker. The newly born little dragon is grey and white, but now it seems to be a little darker. But think again, how is this possible, how can it grow so fast? He shook his head, feeling like he was thinking too much. I looked at the time and found that it was past twelve noon. It's still early, I'll try the serum first. Then he took out the Diranosaurus Rex gene serum and drank it in one gulp. Boom! He suddenly felt a loud noise coming from his body, as if the universe had exploded. The next moment, he fainted. Boom! After Long Rishan fainted, his body began to change slowly, horny skin formed on the skin, the color of the skin turned bronze, and long sharp claws appeared on his hands and feet. At the same time a tail grows from the back. Soon a two-meter small dinosaur appeared on the spot. Ow! Xiao Long saw that his father had become like this, so he jumped off the table and crawled over to shout. Well! Long Rishan slowly opened his eyes and found that Xiao Long was pressing his face, he couldn't help laughing, and then remembered. No, where's my hand? He panicked, he could feel his hand but couldn't see it, and then he rolled over suddenly. Boom! When he got up, he felt his house shake. No, go to the toilet and take a look. Boom bang bang! The ground vibrated with every step I took, and I was a little worried that he would collapse his house. Looking at himself in the mirror, he felt a little uncomfortable. This was obviously a miniature version of the Diranosaurus Rex. Returned to a person. As he raised the thought, the claws on his hands began to slowly disappear. A minute later, he turned back into a human body. Puff! But when he boiled water to wash his hands, he was dumbfounded. The faucet he twisted gently was broken by him, and the water began to spurt. It was only then that he realized how much power he had now. Then he squatted down slowly and turned off the water switch below. Also. This time he tried to use the smallest force possible, and did not break the switch, but left a little gravure on it. It won't work like this, we can't continue to stay at home, we need to control this power as soon as possible. Long Rishan murmured, then he put away his mobile phone and went out. When I came to a park, there were not many people because of the scorching sun at noon. Then he started to run. Bang bang bang! From the beginning, the huge voice gradually became smaller and gradually controlled by him. But if one looks closely, one can see a lot of different shades of footprints on the ground. After half an hour of exercise, he slowly got used to his strength. Long Rishan guessed that his strength with one hand can now reach 500 kilograms, and a person will be killed if he punches him with all his strength. After exercising, he wanted to go back. Um. Suddenly he saw an Isuzu on the road rushing at a very fast speed, and on the road, a three or four-year-old child was staring blankly at the car rushing towards him. 
It was urgent at this time, and Long Rishan didn't think so much, so he put on his armor and rushed over quickly. Boom! He put his hands on the front of the Isuzu car, but the flames blazed under his feet. He was pushed twenty meters away by the car and stopped directly in front of the little boy. Children, don't stay in the middle of the road next time, it's very dangerous. Long Rishan picked up the child, put him in a safe place, and then quickly rushed into the residential area. He didn't want to be pulled to slice. 